Be sincere to me. Is your morning as nice as you wish mine to be? Yes. Don't lie to me. You're still crying. I lost my mom. I miss her so much. I lost my wife. Your mom is my wife. I lost her too. I know how it hurts that no one can fill up the space of a mother in your life. But I do not want to lose my own child. I know it hurts so much losing your mom because no one can replace the space in your heart. I mean the space of a mother. Even me. But please, you can't continue crying. You barely eat nor sleep these days. It's not nice. Dad, why does it hurt me so much? It hurts so much because you truly love your mother. Okay? But please, you cannot continue to cry. But you just have to stop. I feel so hot and downcasted. But I can't show it. I'm supposed to be the source of your strength, not Sarah. My mom was a good woman. I'm not sure I can recover from this. Okay, um, someone needs to get up and go take your bed. Your breakfast is served already. Okay. Okay, your favorite. Okay, I'll see you when I come back. Okay, then. But Dad, where are you going to? To the village. Oh, okay. Good grandma and grandpa for me. I will. See you soon. Bye. Bye. My husband, I fear for our son. Why are you scared for him? It's up to three weeks now. Nicholas has not called me. And Nicholas, I know, until this period now, will not skip a day without calling me his mother. How can you name I agree with you. Uh, but you have to take it easy. Uh, he is probably still recuperating from the effect of his wife's death. <laughs> It's already one year and three months. He lost, I mean, we lost his wife. And from all that is happening around us now, Nicholas is not healing in any way at all. He's not recovering from the shock. He's not. Well, he's always like that when a man loses uh, his wife, you know. But, but the person I feel for the most is Chimwanya the daughter. Okay. Yeah, because mm. she's the one who is having the most effect, uh, more than any other person. Thank God you know. That is more reason he should do what we have been advising him to do all this while. Who yes. Is? Getting himself another wife, of course. Mm. I agree with you on that. Okay. I mean, getting another wife will help the healing process. Mm -hmm. yes. And it even help him recover, help the little girl. Before we lose him and lose our uh, our granddaughter. Ah. 
may the gods forbid that. Uh. No, I will not lose my son. Ah. Then let him do the needful. Uh, yes, I think we need to work towards that. I agree with you 100 percent Because the presence of a wife in that house will help in a in a, 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 a in fact in a long way. To help him go a long way. Uh, I agree with you. Take care of the baby, take care of him. I mean, make him heal faster. And I was trying to just direct her where she was going to. And that was lies. All. Lies. But that was. I saw you holding her waist. Me? I saw you both looking into each other's eyes. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Did you see me as a fool? Like I'm high or something? Baby, see, it's not. Please, listen. I'm. Please. All I'm asking for is just give me a chance to explain myself out. See, what you saw, it's not what it meant. Really? Uh, come on, I can do all that to you. For real? Yes. Okay. All right. Who is this? No, Who is this? No, it's no, me. That's not you. No, it, it's me, but like... Sounded so urgent on the phone. I hope all is well. Yes, it will be well if you do exactly as I will advise you. Okay, I'm all ears. If you can make it quick, uh, uh, it, that will be fine because I need to rush back to the city. My daughter is there all alone. That is the point. That is your usual talk. You left her all alone, all by herself over there. What you can find for yourself? Hey, hey, hey. You, you just calm down, calm down. Uh -uh. We didn't invite him here for you to scream at. Okay? Um, uh, Nicholas. This is the point. The point we are trying to make here. Your daughter is there. All by herself. Eh? Now, she has lost the mother. So she needs a mother figure to take care of her. Huh? Now look at yourself. You are struggling to go back now. You also need help. You need a woman that will take care of you also. Therefore, we have decided that we prevail on you to find another wife for yourself that will take care of all this. Okay? I mean, you have suffered for two... two. Papa, is this the reason you called me all the way from the city to the village? It is enough reason, more than enough reason for us to invite you over. It is two years and three months you lost your wife to the cold hands of death. And you have successfully refused to move on. Look at you. You have become a shadow of yourself. You can't eat. Look at how slim you are. And what the last time you had a proper meal? Is it about your daughter? Only God knows what that one is going through in the city. Why don't you want to marry? Why? Um, the thing there is that I still love my wife and I love her so much. And I'm not ready to have anything to do with any other woman. Yes, that is it. If you don't mind, I have a lot of things to do at the Nicholas, city. I have what? to go back now. Nicholas, you want to pluck out the only eye? With which I see, you are my only son, and I will not be alive and watch anything bad happen to you. Oh, my man. 
anything. I can't you not saying anything. Mm, calm down, calm down. Look, this is okay. Naba, just go. Calm down. This is the wrong approach for handling things like this. There's a better way of doing it. Okay? He's still mourning his wife. So take it easy on him. For how long? Does he want to mourn her forever? Two years and three months, he's still mourning. Maybe he wants to join her in debt. Ah, come on. You, you are not a doctor of mourning now. You cannot be prescribing how somebody should mourn the dead. You know, the way one mourns depends on the relationship with the deceased when he or she was still alive. So please, just, just give him time. He will come around. He better does it all. He better does come around as quickly as possible. I won't take it. What is that? I got to What is that? I do I want to do in there as well. I love him so much. I care about him. I love him with everything in me. Only do this to me. Only do this to me. <laughs> and I still stupidly love him. Wasted my time more than I expected. Are they okay? You're fine. Did you send my regards? They didn't really give me the time to send your regards to them. What happened? Mm, never mind. It's nothing. I wish to know that. Tell me. You can imagine they were asking me to get married to another woman. about it too. I think that would be a good idea. Hey, 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 don't tell me you're considering it. Dad, listen, no matter how good she might be, but she'll be a good source of consolation no matter how. No one can ever take a place that your mother left in my heart. I think you should think about it. Hey, listen. This discussion has to end and I don't want us to talk about it again. Do you understand? Okay, Dad. I'll never talk about it again. Good. I'm sorry. Um, Daddy, I'm hungry. Okay, then. Let me make something for us to eat. Okay. Should I follow you? Mm -hmm. I drove down to a village like a 
a madman because they sounded very urgent. When I got there, they told me that I need to get married. That is it. Are you not surprised? Why should I be? You talk as though you don't know your parents again. Especially Mama. <laughs> I knew that was exactly what they're going to tell you the moment you get to the village. I knew. So tell me, what was your response? Oh, what else? I told them that I would never have anything to do with any other woman. That I love my wife. Yes. Brother, you need a woman in this house. This house is too big for you to stay alone with your daughter. You need a wife. Yes. Right. Even you. Huh? See, nothing anyone will say or do that will make me change my mind. I've made up my mind. This is my life. I choose how to live it. Okay? Brother, you know it's not all about you anymore. You have a daughter in the picture. She needs a mother figure now more than ever in her life. Yes. Now you're beginning to sound like Mama. Brother, that is the gospel truth. Listen. One day, your daughter might ask you a question that you will not be able to answer. Think about it. The house is just too lonely for her to stay alone. It's too big. Anyway, I need something cold. Baby, baby, please wake up. I want to talk to you. Please wake up. Can't you wait till morning? Baby, I huh? can't sleep. Please. What is it? Baby, it's about my brother. Your brother? Yes. What happened to him? He has refused to get married or give another woman a chance since the demise of his wife. And how is that my problem? It's because of his daughter. She will soon start to feed the vacuum her mother created and... And what? Now I'm asking you. And what? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? You have never gotten pregnant since we got married. Let alone a miscarriage. Not to talk of having your own child. Yet you are here, crying over another person's daughter. My husband, it's not just another person's daughter. It's my only brother's child. I don't care. If I were you, I would focus on making my burning womb truthful. Instead of gambling into other people's affairs. Let this be the very first and the last time that you would wake me from sleep because of something this trivial. Nonsense. <laughs> Just for a night. I don't know how long. Because my strength is seriously failing me this time. It's failing me. Hmm. 
So what is it this time around? I woke my husband up last night to tell him about my brother's predicament. He rained unimaginable insults on me. Let me guess. He reminded you once more that you are yet to give him children. Exactly. I don't know why he chose to torment me with that. He rubs it on my face as if it's my fault. You know I blame you for all that? Yes, I blame you. I don't understand. I am medically okay. Am I God that gives children? Exactly my point. So the next time he tells you something synonymous to that, you look him in the eye and rain his souls on him. Because you know what? All of this is his fault. Last I checked, he bluntly refused when you suggested you both go for a medical checkup. Right? I'm just tired. I'm just too tired. I'm tired of the whole thing. I'm tired. I'm tired. It's okay. You don't have to. Just be strong. Everything will be fine. It's right? fine. It's fine. It's fine. Talking about your brother. I think I can be of help. How? I can marry your brother. <laughs> can you just be serious for once? Just be serious for once. The last I checked, you still had a boyfriend. Ooh, that. Do you have an eye, uh... Long done. History. How come you didn't tell me anything about that? It takes me back to memory lane and I hate being there. And your brother. You know I've never met him. Except of course in pictures. I've never seen him face to face. And that is the more reason why you should forget that we had this conversation. <laughs> don't get you. What is dating for? I mean, of course it is for getting to meet each other, knowing one another. You know what? Let me get you a drink. I think you need one. Let, Let me get you one. It's mm. always welcome. I'm coming. But I'm serious. Mm. I'm coming now. Think about it, girl. What is going on? Come on, come on, come on, come on. How are you? Lonely or the... Lonely or the right? Okay. Right now, that is back. Hmm? You're not going to be lonely again. I'll go upstairs, remove my clothes, freshen up, hmm? then come down and cook your favorite meal. Okay, Daddy. What do you think? Okay. You happy, right? Yes, I okay, am. Okay, just relax. I do not want you to do anything. Okay. Don't stress yourself. Okay, then. I'll surprise you now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, sit. Okay. I'm coming, okay? Okay. Go to the street and take some ice cream and relax yourself. Okay. Right, I need some stuff, okay? Okay. Go now. Oh my God! 
Mom said you can cook while your eyes are closed. Suddenly, you mistakenly cut yourself with a knife. And this has never happened before. I'm glad you said mistakenly. There's always a first time in everything. It's obvious that you don't concentrate anymore. It's as if you're present, but your spirit is far. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that you're always thinking about mom. That is why you upset my dad. It's high, it's high time you open your heart and love again. Have, have, have I not warned you? I've warned you time without number. To stop talking about this same issue. But they're just proving stubborn. The next time I hear it from you, I'll flog you. Do you get that? I'm sorry, Dad. You can keep this thing. Trash this one. I missed you, my love. Thank you for forgiving me. Thank you for accepting me back. Ah, I promise you, I'll always be by your side. And nothing, nothing will come in between us again. You know, I love you more, right? I promise to always be by your side. And I promise to, I would always be by your side. And nothing, nothing ever again can separate us. Come here. Thank you for the second chance. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
What are you trying to do now? What is it? Eh? Baby, you're my husband. We are married couple. I'm trying for us to do what married couple do to make children. Hmm? Noyelum. Yes? Don't you ever in your life wake me from my productive sleep again. Don't ever try it too. Don't ever try it. My love, my love. It's been months. It's been months you've not touched me. How will I get pregnant? Hmm? How? You have not sowed your seed inside of me for so long. I have been sowing my seed on this rocky ground you call a womb for years now. And it has never bared fruit. I am tired of sowing. Good night. My heart is burning. So, sir, judging from my analysis, uh, sorry, I mean analysis in this particular uh, goods will do well in the forest market. Uh, sorry, I mean in the, in the foreign market. <laughs> sir, sorry, let me just start this presentation very well. Permission not granted, Mr. Nicholas. It's obvious that your body is here, but your spirit is wandering around. Sir, I'm, I'm here. Just give me one more chance. I will do it very well now, perfectly. That means you didn't prepare for this presentation. Mr. Nicholas, I've given you the leverages to start afresh twice, which is something I don't normally do. Um, I'm not convinced enough to give you this contract. I'm sorry. Sir, please. Please, you just have to give me this contract. If I don't get it, my company might go bankrupt. Mr. Nicholas, in as much as you are my friend, you should know that I don't miss sentiments with business. I, I think you should go sort yourself out and find another investor. Sir, please, I can do it well now, okay? I'm sorry. Have a wonderful day. That contract means the whole world to me. Without the contract, my company might fold. Ah, may God forbid. May God forbid such a thing would never happen. God will not allow it. I have prepared day and night for this presentation. All he could tell me is to is that I was distracted by something else. Of course you are. Let's tell ourselves the truth. This is the third investor that has refused to work with your company in the space of two months. And the reason they gave is simply because your presentation is not convincing enough. It's not convincing enough. It's not my fault. Whose fault is it? It's, it's not just my fault. Whose fault is it then? Hmm? You know the right thing to do. Why not just do it and save yourself all the stress? Hmm? Just wait. This is 
It's fine. Everything will be fine. I believe another investor will come. And this time around, it will work out. Don't lose hope. Please, brother. Hi. Oh. Brother, please. Take it easy. Hi. What is it? Hi! Uh, was a dream? That same nightmare? Yes! Uh. Hey! This one was very clear. Nicholas had a ghastly motor accident. What? This, this time, he didn't make it. He didn't survive. God forbid that thing! Our only son can never die! Amen! 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 Come, let us pray. Oh, let us pray. Oh. Hi. Hello, Nicholas. Good morning, I didn't sleep well. The one I managed to sleep, I had that terrible dream again. Just a dream? No, did you just say that? Hello, Nicholas. Nick, hello? What did he say? What else would he say? He said it's just a dream that I shouldn't pay attention to it. But the way I'm having this same dream, uh, dream I've had for three times. First, second, third. The same dream. It's like God is trying to show something to me. And I won't ignore it. I agree with you. God is telling us something. Yes. Yes, I don't need to pay deaf ears to it. Um, have you talked to Noye about it? No. Okay, please call her now. Call her. Tell her to put words across to Nicholas so that we can do something. Okay, so go. Yes, so. Let me quickly call her. Hello, Nanya? Hello? Uh -huh. I, I want you to help me uh, talk to Nicholas. Um, Chugunana, I invited you to come all the way from the city because I want to talk to you about your brother. Wambiko, talk to him to save himself from this impending doom. Doom? I don't understand, Mama. I've had this terrible dream about your brother involving himself in a ghastly motor accident. I've not had this dream once, not twice, not thrice, but five consecutive times this week. Talk about the ones I've ha having the same dream in the past. But just this week, five times. Uh, yes, I agree with you. God forbid. Uh, see, you know, the death of his wife had serious negative impact yes. on him. So as it is right now, anything is possible. You know, yes, that is why you really need to talk to him. If I tell you both that I am not tired of talking to Nicholas, I will be lying. I have tried. I have tried to convince him to get another wife. Or at least give another woman a chance. But he said no. 
It appears as though I'm overstepping my boundaries. So I had to slow down. I had to. Don't slow down. He is your brother. His well-being should be your paramount concern. Casey, why are you talking like this? Of course, you're for a Mama, do you know that even his daughter begged him to get her another mother? But he said no. He's just keeping strong head about the whole thing. He's been strong headed about the whole thing. Uh, even at that, eh? you, you will not slow down. Okay? Continue to talk to him. Because as it is right now, anything is possible. Mm -hmm. I, we don't want to lose our son. At all. Then do something. You see him there every time in the city. Thank you. Uh, so, how is your husband? Hey, Papa, my husband is fine. He sent his regards. Okay, that's fine. What is some of this? Yes, Papa. You're looking very good. <laughs> Which means he's trying. He's trying. He's trying. <laughs> he's trying. <laughs> Yeah. I will do that, Mama. Yeah. I will. Uh, good day, Mama. Is it not that barren woman I call my wife? Mama, you won't believe that she left me in this house and went to the village to see her parents, leaving me here to starve. Well, that's all she does, move from one place to the other. Nem, I don't know, honestly. I believe you, Mama. Uh-huh, no, that reminds me. Has uh, Mazu Keke come to collect the money I told you to give him? Okay. Uh, you, you can keep the rest of the money. Eh? And also tell the engineer that I'll be back by weekend to come see how he's going. Hmm? All right, Mama. Take care. My heart is Go and bring chair. Go and bring chair. She's our guest. Uh, uh. Papa, good evening. Oh, yeah, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. Uh, go and bring chair for her now. Of course. Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you, Papa. Uh. Mama, you're welcome. I know you're wondering on the reason I asked you to come again. Because the other time was about the impending doom coming on your brother. But this one is special. Is something very different. I want you to help me. I want you to help me talk to your brother. To take another wife. Before they contracted this marriage, the priest said, until death do us part. Now death has done them apart. He's still living in the euphoria of I love my wife, I love my wife. I got on a love. Let him get another wife. To, if not to care for him, to care for the daughter. I got to see I call this you this kind of matter. Wife, is it not a beautiful thing? Of course, he that finds the wife finds a good thing. And obtains favor from the Lord. So why is his own different now? Yes, mm. uh, Lonye. Your mother is right. Mm. Eh? Yes, we are aware that. He loved his wife so much when she was alive. Hmm? But it's time he moved on. Exactly. I mean, <laughs> even the woman, wherever she is right now, would want him to move on. 
I don't get stuck with this. What was the word he used? Euphoria. Yes. Get stuck with this euphoria of uh, I love my wife. I love my wife. I, I love my love wife. Uh -uh. Ha. Mama, I have spoken to him several times, and each time I do, he will just shut me off. He won't talk to me. He won't call me, unless I call to apologize to him. That is the only way we will start talking again. I don't know what else to do. I have tried all I could. But like you said, I will keep pushing. I will not give up. No He's problem. my brother. No problem. How is uh, Chimwanya? Mama, she's fine. Well, she's been complaining the same thing, you know. She's been telling him to get another wife for his own happiness and for her own well-being. Eh? I don't know what else to do, Mama. And that to do. is where the problem is. That is where the problem is. Nicholas is being selfish here. He's selfish. I mean, how can he be thinking of himself alone, forgetting that he has a daughter that needs taking care of? Exactly. Eh? What of us? That's I'm missing a, 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 I don't understand. I eh? know ah, he has to stop being selfish. Um, Nonyelum, why I call you Nonyelum is when matters come like this, you become my part of me. I don't know how you're going to do it, but you must do it. Talk to Nicholas because this new wife might even help us to 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 take care of this impending misfortune. At least to avert it. For him being with his wife in the house, we are talking about a ghastly accident. It can be averted. Because him being in the house with the wife, he won't go out that day, and that is how his life will be saved. What is wrong with you? Haven't I called you before to say you tell, tell you this? I just remembered, Mama. I'll talk to him. I'll try my best. Keep talking to him. Don't be tired. Yeah, but it's okay now. She says she will talk to ah. him. Uh, you are a mother too. You better to know. Oh my, you better in a. Amen, Mama. Are you putting the responsibility? as if she's the cause. I don't understand. You have already appealed for her to talk, and she agreed that she would talk. As a matter of fact, she has been talking. I don't to deserve these hurtful words from you. What? I just came back. I've not even dropped my bag. Besides, I told my husband that I'll be visiting my parents in the village. I did. I told him. Did I permit you to go? Mumbano, I do job, go. Answer him. Did he permit you? Baby, you can't you can go to it. You said I can go, you did. Have you forgotten? No, leave her. The only thing she and her useless mother know how to do is to gossip my son and me. But not to worry, because I am going to cut your mouth shut, including your mother's own. Trust me, you know what I can do. With all due respect, I do not appreciate the fact that you have to get my mother involved in this. It does not concern her. Please keep her out of this. 
I really went to the village to discuss about my brother's issues. Nothing else. Nothing else, Mama. Young lady, if you ever in your life speak to my mother in that tone again, I swear I will slap sanity out of you. Are you mad? Are you crazy? How dare you? In my presence. Are you crazy? Hey, leave her. Leave her. I know how to insult me. Young lady, let me tell you, for your information, I have come to stay. No going back. No going out. No coming in. You see, I say, I am going to cut your horn. You see this horn? You do it like a pure queen. So, my cut here, and I will cut your wings. You know me. Trust me. You know what I can do. Instead of you to give me grandchildren, you are here doing nonsense. Shalom. Hey, guy, for my husband. Is this all you can say? This is all you can say. Try this nonsense the next time, and I will show you the other side of me that you do not know. Rubbish. My husband. Hey, my husband. Is that all you have to say? Oh, you expect him to beat me? Beat me. Your husband did not beat me. Beat me. You don't want to beat me again. Come on to conceive. Come on to spread your legs wider. All out of Ghana. All your mates, the people that are married same time with you, fat it home at that now. Your own, the guru no barren womb, no ever. You cannot conceive for me. You cannot give me grandchildren. In order. Like in short, I have nothing to tell you. You will see what I will do to you. Just say. My heart is pulling me oh, 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 to our house. And you didn't deem it fit to tell me. Have you gone totally crazy? How dare you call me by my name? My husband. My darling husband. I am the woman of the house. You're supposed to have informed me ahead of time. For so she seen. Eh? What have you contributed to this family to earn yourself the title of the woman of the house? Tell me, because last I remember, you are barren. And for the record, does my mother need to write an application before she comes to visit her son? What you are doing to me is not fair. It's not fair. God knows it's not, it's not fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. You've gotten yourself another husband in that office of yours. Excuse me? Yeah, you are quite excused. You can go to work if you want. But be rest assured that if you step an inch from here, you'll go to your parents' house. Mama. Mama, why are you doing this? 
I am a working class lady. I can't just stop work just like that. Mama, please. The only work required of a good woman is to open her legs wider, produce children, prod them to growth. Every other work is worthless and useless. Oh, the last time I checked, your husband is capable of taking care of the family. No need for you to work. Mama, you don't understand. I have put in a lot of work in the company. I just got promoted. Yes, this is the worst time for me to quit. Mama, please try and understand. I have really worked so hard for this. I beg of you, please. Please. Oh, you got promoted? Yes, Mama. That means more work is required of you. <sighs> My beautiful daughter-in-law, for your information, I am here to fix things. And that includes stopping you from work. Ah, but at the same time, if you want to test my rods, you can disobey me. No, 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 no. I'm not trying to stop you from work. You can go ahead with your work. But this house and your company, you have to make your choice. You have to choose one, just one. I'm not fussing you. You're so beautiful. Mrs. Promotion. Have a nice day. do the cooking for you. You know, I can't be in this as I'm what she cook. It's unheard of. Besides, he just came back, so you need to go and rest. Okay? <laughs> How does it concern you? Huh? Listen, let me tell you. Henceforth, I'll be the one to cook for my son. Ever since he started cooking for him, there is nothing fruitful that came out of it. Oh, yes. And to add to that, look at how slain he is now. Was that the way he was when he came to marry you? Awkward? In a she concussion near Bunia with your charms. As you come on up, you won't matter. I really came to help. And who needs your help? The words you've spoken to me. It's too hard for me. I can't take it. I can't take it. No, my shin and wall. My shin and wall. If someone sees you and I see you, the person will say you are a better person, full of evil. My dear, I nearly had an accident today. How did it happen? I was driving on my own home. And one careless driver came out from nowhere, almost ran over me. 
That's a lie, Dad. He wasn't careless. You were the one who was careless. Why did you... I said that because you never concentrate in anything. I tell you this. If you die, I'll follow you and die too. God forbid. None of us will die in Jesus' name. I cover us with blood of Jesus. Say amen. Amen. Good. Daddy. Yeah? You know the right thing to do at this point. If you don't, you have yourself to be blamed. I've told you. Where is the posh Nanya Loma used to know? How do you mean? Nanya, have you taken a glance at yourself in the mirror? I'm sorry to say, but girl, you look really unkept. Hmm. And that is what my husband and his mother want. I guess they have succeeded in stripping me of my self-esteem. And you let it happen. What can I do? Need I remind you that your husband is never going to find you attractive looking like this. And while he's not intimate with you, it makes it highly impossible for you to get pregnant. I hope you know that, right? Catherine, my friend. You see, at this point, I don't care. I don't care anymore. Wait, hey. I'm just tired. You don't care. I don't care. Did you just say you don't care? You don't care if you're intimate with your husband. And you want children. Really? The fact that you always travel to the village to gossip my lovely son and I with your useless parents is not enough for you. You have the effrontery, the privilege, the audacity to bring in your jobless friend into this house. Which I did not talk Hey, what happened Mama, she is just a friend. I think I can introduce myself. My name is Ketri. At last I checked, I was not jobless. Where did this jobless rat creep out from? KBC Makapota. <laughs> I think the question should rather be why did you leave your husband's house to come into another woman's husband's house to cause problems? <laughs> Nanya? No. I think I would just, you know, take my pretty self out of this place. Of course. I have important things to do. You know I'm a very busy lady. I know. I know never. Have a nice day, madam. Take care. Yeah, see you some other time, girl. Okay. Eh? No, you So this is it. No, you This is it. You now bring in your jobless friends into my son's house to insult me. Okay? So, everybody, what do you want to go to this extent? Adi Joshua, I am sick and tired of your troubles. At this point, take my name off your mouth. Excuse me. No, no, no. No, 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 You are walking out on me. 
Am I the one that insulted you? Hmm? She is gone. So let me be. Please, please, I'm so sorry. Sorry for what? I didn't do it intentionally, okay? And you're still able to fix my dress? Uh, uh, my white dress? Eh? I you, you, you're not even driving well. This is how to drive. And you dressed well. You're looking good. Oh, I, I, please. I, I can actually take you home, so go change your dress, okay? Uh -huh. I'm so sorry about that. Oh? Do you know where I was going to? I didn't, I don't, I don't know. Dress so much you can do for, for those shoots with my, my white outfit. You've ruined the white, white outfit for me. Oh, so sorry. I ruined my photo shoot. I can take you home, so you go change. Your dress. Okay? I'm so sorry. You've been my entire day, it's not just my outfit. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, about how do I open this door? Let me open it for you. Okay? Hold on. You look good, though. You look wonderful. You look nice. Baby, you look beautiful. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, put a smile on that face. That's good. That's better. That's better. <laughs> it's not even funny. 
I can't believe I'm here familiarizing with somebody who ruined my beautiful dress hours ago. I'm supposed to be raining fire and, and hell upon you right now. I said I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I'm taking you to a place where I'm going to change all that. I'm going to buy you new dresses, okay? So your day will be beautiful. Yeah. Just watch and see what will happen right now. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, really? I'm going to make your day right now. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so... I just got lost in the ocean of your beauty. Mm. Stop flattering me. I am not, for real. Thank you. So, were you going on a date when I splashed that dust on you? No, not at all. So what were you doing there, all alone, wearing white and white, on that dusty road? I was going for a photo shoot. But as you can see, I have to postpone it to tomorrow. Because I ruined your day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, okay? I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. I forgive you. <laughs> so eat your food. Bon appetit. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. I had fun today. Me too. <laughs> you know, it's it's so funny how it feels like I've known you all my life. We just met today and we've had a date already. That's emotional chemistry. That's all. Thank you so much. You are welcome. So, let's do this again. Of course. <laughs> okay, so I should be headed inside. Okay. You sure you don't want me to come inside? Next time when I'm ready. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. Okay. okay. Thank okay. you. Bye. Yes, bye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> bye. Take care. Yes. Bye. You know, in the presence of the Lord, there is fullness of joy. Yes. Dad, you're so funny. So you don't want to tell me why you're this happy? All oh, this excitement, what is it for? I just told you that in the presence of the Lord, there is fullness of joy. Can't you feel it? <laughs> Since you don't want to tell me why you're this happy, well, I pray it lasts long. Amen. Can I help? No, no, no. Just go there. The sitting room. Sit down, relax. I'm going to prepare something delicious. Like you will love it. I like the sound. Give it five. <laughs> <laughs> 
husband they are fine in the city. <laughs> uh, did she call you today anything? Anything like what? I'll be a bad person if I didn't tell you, but I don't want people to look at me as if I'm a gossip. Understand that? No, you're not a gossip. Just tell me, did anything happen? No. Just that um Juliana Molisa. Mm. I overheard her telling someone that she is going to the city to make your daughter's life unbearable for her since she cannot give her grandchildren. My own daughter? Yes. Juliana, to make my daughter's life unbearable? Yes, well, that's what I hear. Oh, yeah, but you know, I'm No problem, mom. Don't worry, oh. Thank you very much for the information, oh. How is your mother? She's very, very fine. Please extend my regards to her, oh. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. That was what all she told me not long ago. No, no, wait. You mean Oye has been facing this kind of problems in her marriage? And she's been lying to us all this way? Okay, Fonsenia. She will leave that marriage. I mean, she will definitely leave that marriage if I discover Olisa is part of this whole thing. Umba. Umba! Don't be talking of divorce now. Okay. Uh -uh. All we need to do is to invite our daughter home and talk sense into her. I don't understand. How is it her fault that, that her important husband has not been able to make her pregnant all this while? When you got before here, is it her fault? Dinika, what about his son? How can you open your mouth to, to spew that kind of nonsense about our in law? Don't, don't, don't say that again. What is it? That our in law is important? Is he not? If you were to be a full fledged man, complete in everything, you should have had two children by now. Ah, no, 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 don't, don't say that. Don't. Me, I believe if she meets the right man, she'll be pregnant. Okay, Nedra. You can discuss whatever it is that brought you here, outside. Baby, why are you talking to me this way? What is it? What have I done wrong? Tell me so I can apologize to you. What you did wrong is coming to my house uninvited. Well, babe, for past weeks now you've not called me. Oh, oh, wait. That's why you had to badge into my privacy. By showing your ugly face here unannounced? Oh, babe, I don't understand you anymore. Why are you talking to me like this? Are you avoiding me? You know, I can see you are still moving around the whole town. Wearing stuff I got for you. Showing off like Fresh boy thingy with the things I got for you. Instead of you to humble yourself and get back to work, by now you should have carried over 15 blocks on your head and be able to waste small money to, to buy bread and pure water. You're wasting your time. Anyway, your time is up. Out of my compound. But babe, see, it's <laughs> see, I just wanted to know I like I need some money. I don't I need to step up, you know. Come on, please. My goodness, she disgusts me. Get out! But that's... Mm -hmm. 
Ah! Over you fuck up, oh. Been making my stay in that house a living hell. No, you. You mean you've been going through all this, all this while, and you kept it to yourself? I don't want to watch my family leanings outside. Eh? I have no idea what I have done to God for Him to place such a curse on me. Mm -mm. Do not even mention God. Because God is innocent. It's your fault. I'll tell you the truth to your face. It's your fault, Noye. It's because you allow your husband treat you anyhow. So tell me. Tell me why his mother will not be so comfortable coming to your matrimonial home to treat you like a piece of trash. By now, I expect you to drag that woman by the hair and throw her out of your house. It's not as easy as you think. It's not, it's not that easy at all. Do you know that whatsoever the mother tells him, he will believe. He will believe her. He will not question her. Not even one bit. You don't know what I'm passing through. That's because you indulge them all. It is. <laughs> well, God knows why he does not bring such people my way. Because Heavenly Father knows what I am capable of. I won't even take it one bit. It beats that. <laughs> anyway, don't even let this people weigh you down. Hmm. My dear, they're weighing me down. They're mm. weighing me down already. Mm -mm -mm. It's not worth it. Don't let it weigh you down, my dear. Show them that you're strong. You're a strong woman. Alright? Do I offer you? I don't even want to take anything. You have to. You have to. You have to take something that came yourself down. You don't just get to. anything, you know? I'll be right back, yeah? No How are you and your husband, my in law? <laughs> Mama, I'm fine. Eh? And my husband is also fine. Eh? Will you keep quiet? Shut up there! Mama, I'm fine. My husband is also fine. Will you shut out your, 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 your lying mouth? But I'm not lying. I'm not lying. As you can see, I'm fine. My husband is, is also fine. Is, is there any problem? Since you don't want to tell us the truth, did your mother-in-law, Juliana, only says about her not come to the city? And as we speak now, she's still in the city. Oh, that! Oh, that! that daughter of Mwadi Eganya! Are you mad? That is not enough for you to tell us. Mama, she came. But she'll be leaving soonest. Besides, she's a nice person. She has been taking good care of me and she's also homely. If I slap you... If you lie to me, eh? I will forget the fact that you're a grown woman, married adult, and we give you a resounding slap. You said that you're lying to me. Are you mad? Mama, I don't understand. Keep I... quiet! Mama, I don't understand. Why, do you, why don't you understand? Oh. As a matter of fact, I will, I will slap you so that I will reset what your mother has reset in, in that as own slap. Oh. Eh? You think what? we would find out? So, no, 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 tell me. You, you, you are having problems with your husband and now your, your mother-in-law came in again to, to compound the problem. And here you are saying, yeah, my husband is taking me fine. You idiot! You think we won't find out? <laughs> Mama, I'm tired. Papa, my strength, my strength is failing me. All what I've I've been going through all what I've endured is for me to save my marriage. 
just that if I told them you, you earlier, you would have asked me to leave the marriage. Mm. But I don't want to leave my marriage, mm. my man. Okay. And you prefer to die in that marriage? You prefer to die in that marriage? Have you seen or heard about women that died in their marriage? Are you mad? Tell Juliana that I am coming to that city to meet her. Well, she's married to herself now. Tell her I'm coming. Tell her where her own madness ended is where my own is coming from. You robbed him with fire. Oh, God, for them more. My foyer to foyer kiss here, foyer kick here. Oh, God, I'm not more. I'm not going here. He judged your client because of that miserable woman. Rubbish. It's okay now. Because I gave her time for her who stopped to marry. That is why she wants to use my own time. It's okay. I, I, see, I don't understand yet. Yeah. You are saying, you are saying, fire, fire, fire. Are you from Martin of Fire? No, uh, please, it's okay. D don't worry, okay? Don't worry. <laughs> I, I will handle things. I'll take care of things, okay? Don't worry. Don't mind your mother. Right? Always very hot. It's okay. I understand you, okay? Wipe right. your tears and cry no more. I'm a coron you, I'm a chinyaka karaya Keep it men dear, just for a minute Mama, good morning You don't wake mm? <laughs> I'm still in my room sleeping I actually prepared your breakfast Whose breakfast? Your own mama Me? Eat what you cooked Yes mama Chukwa chukwa Where? The only thing you know in this house is to prepare food Okay? You don't know what other women do in their husband's house. Eh? You cooked. You want me to eat? Potter, potter. I will not. By the way, where are you going dressed this way? Hey, Mama, I'm going for my morning routine workout. You know, it's very good for me. So I'm, I'm trying to go and jog a bit down the street. You want to go and do exercise? Yes, Mama. Hey! Help me, help me. No wonder you have not been able to conceive. No wonder etu beato me ya fokwe mo amo. Every day you go out to jog. So how will it happen? How can you be able to conceive? Even if you conceive, how can you know the one to give birth to when you conceive a female gene and it mixes up with a male gene? What will you give birth to? It's only God that will know what you give birth to. Eh? Hey! I am not the doctor. He is the one that advised that I should be working out every morning. I should be exercising that it will help me to conceive very fast. That is why I'm exercising. Aram of that doctor. Uh -uh. Does that doctor know what I'm going through in this house where you are? Dr. Homer, how can he be able to tell you what to do? Say that you will be doing exercise. Okay, step an inch today. That place that you went, you will jog from there to your father's house. You will not return here again. I don't know if doctor, I say doctor. Which useless doctor? What did he know? Come on, will you get inside? Because if you try walk out, you will not come back to this house again. I don't know if I'm doctor, I say doctor, I say Eh? Get inside! Mama, I am not the doctor. I, I, I am not the doctor. Let's do what the doctor advised. If you want me to conceive, Mama. What did your doctor advised? What did he advise? Did you not hear what I said? Get inside! I just come and eat your food. Eh? Please, yes. I say, mad. Chukwu ajo. Nangeri poto poto isi. Oh man, me. Get inside, bigo. I make a zibo mad. I say, get inside. Or do you want me to push you off there? Get inside. You want to go and do exercise? Where? In this house. Instead of you to open your legs and conceive, give me grandchildren. You know, in a, in a exercise, you see the car, you see the Is that what you are here for? Get to him, man. More and more, more than grandchildren. On our colleague, I'm more of ya. No, 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 just because you're not here. <laughs> so, how's my baby doing? Can we at least hang out? 
Oh, okay. My lady, can I take you out today? Same place by 8 p.m. I hope that will be okay. I'll be expecting you. I miss you. all the time makes me happy thank you for loving me I'm so blessed to have you I've not really told you anything about myself and I know when I finish telling you things about me I don't know if you still love me love overlooks all flaws, no matter what. Really? Mm -hmm. But you still have to know that I am a widower with a daughter. I still love you. I even love you more. Really? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. So when am I meeting your little princess? Whenever you're ready. You'll meet her whenever you want. I mean, you've made me the happiest man on earth. I can't even imagine seeing myself loving again after the death of my wife. Thank you so much. Cheers to us. sound smarter than I was told. <laughs> My pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> so where is your father? Um, he's coming already. Oh, look at him. <laughs> yeah. I can see what I'm talking about. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Dinner is served already. So, shall we? Of course. <laughs>
yourself worked up. Why are you doing this to yourself? Huh? Uh, look, I don't want you to develop high BP because I don't have the, the money required to, to treat you. Please, take it easy now. I'm just imagining what my poor girl, my only daughter, is going through down in her husband's house, knowing full well who Juliana is. Very troublesome. Oh, saying kri kri kri, okay, She be tormenting her there now. Um, look, don't worry yourself. Hmm? Our daughter Nunye is a peace-loving person. Hmm? She will not do anything to infuriate Juliana. Huh? She, I'm sure she will do everything to maintain peace. So please don't worry yourself. Be cool. As if you didn't see her tears that day. The tears she was shedding. I know that pain came from her heart. That tears came from her heart. From her innermost soul. And it pierced my heart like a sword. But what a movie. Again, that is my why would she be going such through such a pain? Why? What did she do wrong? Non Rudy. Does she deserve that ill treatment from Juliana? What is Juliana doing in her in her husband's house? When she should be in her own husband's house. It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. Just take it easy. All we need to do is to pray. Hmm? You, you know the way God works. If we pray, God will put a shield before your heart. So when the arrow comes, it will not pierce. Eh? <laughs> My love, it's okay, let's go. What are you saying? Hmm? Sweetheart, let's go. Hmm? Wipe your tears and cry no more. I'm not gonna you, I'm not gonna take care of you. Keep it mendia, just you know, for it. I lost my wife. Life became so dark and frustrating. Till you walk to it and illuminate it. These past few months with you have been memorable. If I'm given an opportunity, I will ask you to be the mother of my unborn children. Catherine, please, will you marry me? Tell me, why is that your useless evil mother-in-law? Hmm. 
She went to the market not quite long ago. Oh. What is it? Why are you making your face like that, baby? What is going on? Really be serious with you. Of course he is. <laughs> oh, I wonder what Jeff had to be going through by now. You know, you know how serene, beautiful moments. Oh, come on, my darling. I'm always happy for you. Come off it. Come here. <laughs> my friend is not Mrs. Oh. oh yeah. This is somebody. Oh yeah. This is somebody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> welcome to the club, darling. I am highly welcome. You know what? <laughs> This calls for a celebration, so let me get something, you know. <laughs> Your most expensive girl. I got you. I know you do. I got you. I know you do. <laughs> This is the lady I told you about that I want to get married to. I brought her so you could know her and uh, see her too. Hey! We don't need to know her anything. Me seeing her, we already know her. From the look on her face and the way she smiles, this is beauty in and out. <laughs> there is no need knowing her for that. You see how you're happy you are now? Mm -hmm. You're smiling from tit to tit, flesh to flesh, eh? Mm -hmm. Flashing your laugh. Oh, mom. You're welcome. Thank you. Nah. What? So when are you going to do her traditional marriage? Ah, ah. Slow down now. And we want to be Ah, ah. Okay. Let's start now. Are you doing a relay or 100 meters race? No. Eh? Um, young lady. So which uh, village are you from? I'm from Akoma village, the neighboring village. Akoma village? Ha! I'm going to go to Raka. Daughter of late Mazimba, the popular Pawaita. I don't know if you know him. Ah, yes. Look, he used to be my good friend. Hmm? Yes, you should know him now. Know him. He used to be the best Pawaita in the whole of the villages mm -hmm. around. Eh? As a matter of fact, I used to go to your village for the special palm wine, you know. We combine it with uh, four, four. I don't want to mention it. <laughs> eh, but, uh, oh, I missed him. Oh. May he so rest in peace. Amen. Mm. The dead are more than the living. Of course. Anyway, Nicholas. 
you have my blessings already. Mm. Like your mother said. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> I prepare something nice. Let me bring it so that you share with your wife to be. It's okay. Eh? I trust my wife. <laughs> Let me go and get it. Oh. Mama. Eh? Let me join you. Have you seen her? Again, that was real really properly. <laughs> Mom, let's go. Oh! Oh, wow. Hey. <laughs> Nicholas. Nicholas. You are the true son of your father. Yeah, like, uh, no more. You are the true son of your father. No more. No more. <laughs> Hold on, I'm coming. Could you hide something this vital from me? How? I'm sorry. Please forgive me. You are sorry. And that is supposed to make everything better. Hmm? If not that my mother called to explain everything to me, that you are the girl my brother wants to marry, would you have told me? Would you? I know that there is nothing I say right now that is going to justify my action. Come on, girl. I thought you were going to, you know, spoil things for me. Knowing that you still feel I am going out with Jeffert. How? How will I spoil things for you? You are my best friend. My duty is to protect you no matter what. Listen, just don't break my brother's heart. He has gone through a lot already. Listen, I will not. You don't understand. His heart is so fragile. I know. He's still uh, recovering from the death of his wife. I know all of that. You do? Yes. Trust me. Promise Girl, me. I am more scared losing your brother. Promise. I promise. Then you're forgiven. Come here. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you so much. My sister-in-law. Please. So sorry. It's okay. It's fine. See it. Let me get you something. Welcome to the family, okay? I'm coming. I'll be right back. Thank you. Wait, tell me. What am I hearing? Like you engage with someone? What you heard? You heard from the right source. So it's true. But aren't you ashamed of yourself? You're not ashamed of yourself. Of all men to get engaged to is to get engaged to a second-hand man. A widower. Is that what you left me for? <sighs> you see that widower? That second-hand man. I love him so much. What? And your cheap words will not make a difference. That second-hand man can feed you and your entire generation for a lifetime. Our first hand. What do you have to show for it? Oh, apart from your regular wanting to make love every second. I'm venting your poverty self on me. What do you have to show for it? Well, listen. I am so, so busy. Pretty busy planning my wedding. And I would appreciate it if you do not show your ugly face around me again. That's a lie. I do not want to see you anywhere close to my house. Copy that? Me! Babe! She got engaged. And now, wants to get married to him. Oh, 
Successful marriage ceremony. Yeah. 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 Look, as you are going, drive carefully. Hmm? See, oh, yeah. <laughs> See my beautiful wife. Don't go ahead that girl up. Jeta by Jeta. Jeta by Jeta. Oh yeah. We're going. Okay. No, it's not See, take care of yeah. my brother very well. <laughs> I trust you. <laughs> brother. Take care of my friend. It's okay. Please. Hey, 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 you, 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 where is your husband? Oh, you went to pick something, Papa. Let's Once he's back, we'll be leaving. Let's, let's, oh, okay. Take care, man. Take care of you. Hey. Don't forget to always call me. Okay, oh. Oh, my oh, my sweetie. Check it the choir. Oh, Take care of you, okay? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Bye bye. 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 Bye Mama. All right, my bestie. Bye. Take care. We'll be going for Mugo. Those things and carefully, yo. the content in those bags can feed you and your entire generation and yet unborn. Okay. That was a very nasty word to use on him. But you know the way he staggers all the time with everything he's lifting. Don't break anything inside that bag. But it's not his fault. He doesn't know there are breakable things inside there. Oh, whatever. Come on, I'm let's inside. Go. I look around, nobody is done. All this evil is in vain. How long do you pretend nobody's watching? I look around, nobody is done. All this evil is in vain. How long do you pretend nobody's watching? I look around, nobody is done. All this evil is in vain. Doing what? And, and where's my daughter? What? You forgot to pick my daughter from school? Your own daughter? Excuse me. Just, just, just pray that nothing happens to my daughter. If, because if, if something happens to my daughter, you won't just like it. You won't like it. Taking. Oh, I'm so sorry about that, okay? I'll be in my room. Don't worry, you'll never trip again, okay? Let me prepare something to eat. There is no food in the dining, neither is there food in the port. Wait, did you go to my port? Hmm? 
Didn't your late mother tell you it is wrong to go to another woman's spot without her consent? You didn't know? I'm sorry, Mom. Mom, please, I'm hungry. Do you expect me to leave this TV program and watch it and go out and make something for you to eat? I heard what a prisoner fits for her to eat. Go to the kitchen. It's fine. I'll just take the snacks I brought back from school. Suit yourself. Come, come, come. Get me another cold Fast. your help with my assignment. What did you call it? Your assignment. So do it yourself and don't disturb me again. I tried doing it but I got confused at a point. Uh, what is even wrong with you this girl? What is your problem? Don't you know what to approach somebody? Don't you? Can't you see I'm busy with my nails? I'm sorry to disturb you with my problems. I'm not going to go to the house. If I put me in a chapter, let you need me to go away. I love money, but I can't. Mama? Mama? same food I prepared for my husband that I saw in the waste bin. Is it the same food? Oh yes. And what about it? Is it not that same food that you put your devilish chance in order to subdue my son, not to think of bringing in a more fruitful wife? Oh boy, it will not work. I am here now. Mama, why are you so wicked and heartless at the same time? Why? Mama, you left your husband's house. Came to my to frustrate me. You became a thorn on my flesh. Mama, why? Let me ask you. If I were to be your daughter, God forbid that I would be God's a daughter like you. Mama! Eh? If I were to be your daughter, 
and my mother-in-law is treating me the way you have done just half of the way you have treated me mama how will you feel how will you take it just be honest mama now let me answer you i cannot begat a daughter like you a barren woman god forbid and by the way how dare you talk to me like that do you think we are mates or you feature when a snake behaves abnormal children will use it to tie fire you see this thing that happened? I will tell my husband the moment he comes back. Because I am tired of this. Enough is enough, Mama. Enough is enough. Excuse me. I hit you. Mama, he beats me up so bad. Oh, my body this is my mama. Can you see me? What did you do to him? I did nothing wrong, Mama. Come, nothing. come inside. Mama, I did nothing. Just, just don't worry yourself. Mama, Tell me. What did you say happened? <sighs> don't cry. It's okay. Don't cry. Don't cry. This is very important. I need to hear every detail. So don't cry. Mama, I hope the body is Started beating you. Yes, Started beating you. No problem. It's Mama. okay. When you get it on them, Mama, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Juliana. Juliana, you have done your worst. But this time, she will hear from me. <laughs> Just pull yourself together. You have to go back to the city and pretend as if nothing happened. Vichanyagi, 
and you will hear from me. No, Mama, no, Mama, I can't. I can't go back there. Mama, he wants to kill me. He wants to kill me, Mama. He wants to kill me. Onisa I cannot kill you. I did nothing wrong. I did if nothing. he does, I will wipe out his entire generation. Do you still love your husband? <laughs> Of my husband. And you still want him alive so that the love can continue. Yes, Mama. Then have to go back to the city. <laughs> because if your father should come back to this house and meet you in this condition that only sir laid his filthy hands on you, your father will march through to that city with his gun and shoot him dead before your eyes. So go back to the city. You will hear from me. <laughs> get up, get up, my madro. Get up. <laughs> Hi. Oh, you just fall in my hand. Get up and go to back to the city. <laughs> I know. Only get you. Ah, I know. I have an experience. <laughs> Pretend as if nothing happened. Eh? Oh, my back is dead. I know. I'm going to get your damn Eh? Pretend as if nothing happened. He was punching me. He was punching me. He was punching me for when I'm his wife. It's okay. I'm going to You will hear from me. Stop crying. Okay, when people see you cry, they will think something happened. Okay, Stop mama. crying. Don't cry. Okay, mama. Hear from me. Hey, <laughs> Juliana. Now, if I be here, you see it. Just go. I was it, yeah. Juliana! No problem. Come bye bye. Why oh? You will hear from me. Mm. Juliana. Ina kwa rebe ye sefu. You dare support your son to hit my child. <laughs> you will definitely hear from me. That's it. I guys on your break with Jida. I Mom, you sent for me. And I've been sitting here for a while now. You're just looking at me and you're not talking. What is it? You know, I am your mother, right? Yes, I know you are my mother. And you also know that I want the best for you. Yeah. I know. Then, why are you holding on to that which does not yield any fruit? How do you mean? My son. As you can see, I'm not getting younger. Neither are you. I need grandchildren I need someone to give me grandchildren before I join my ancestors since your wife cannot conceive I want you to get another wife that will give us children who will continue your father's lineage Biko no one Biko you know I have a wife See, 
if you want it to come out from my mouth, if you want me to say it out, so bad, I will give it to you. Your wife is barren. She cannot conceive. I am your mother. I will not advise you wrongly. I will not lead you astray. You need to listen to me and do what I asked of you. I'm not asking for too much. Just get a second wife. Chico. Wipe your tears and cry no more. I'm not gonna know what you're gonna do. Keep it in mind, just for a night. But joy comes to you in the morning. Oh dear, Mama Gama, my heart is bleeding. Oh, oh, oh. What is it? They have finished me. Why are you crying? <laughs> they have finished me. Oh, they have finished me. What happened? <laughs> it has gotten to the point that my mother-in-law <laughs> accuses me of things I know nothing about. <laughs> and that makes my husband know that to beat me up. He what? beats me up. So wait, 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 hold on. You are trying to tell me that only sir mm. let his cursed hands on you? <laughs> Do you know what? Mm. This time around, mm. he's going to have it hot with me. Mm. I am going to sit here and wait for him to return. Mm. I will lay his hands on you, a woman. Please, I don't want you to cause this sin here. <laughs> Please. No. My friend. No, 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 no. He is going to have it hot with me. Please. For what now? Because husband. you are quiet. He's my husband. Let him kill me. Since he has chosen to believe whatsoever his mother said to him Don't about worry. me. No, 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 that's why you have me. You have me for a reason. Mm. Relax. Mm. Let him come back. Mm. For what? Let me beg you something. Men don't like quiet women. They don't like it. It's about to work up. Biko, I want to beg you something. Don't let my brother know about this. Don't tell him about this, please. Don't tell him. He doesn't know about this. Listen, I promise you, I am not going to tell your brother. Okay. But as for me, I'm going to sit here and wait for your husband to come and meet me. <laughs> Unless you tell me why he would raise his hands on you. He didn't see the way he was punching me. He was just punching me as if I'm punching back. Oh my body. Oh my body. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Sorry. 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 Sorry, right? Sorry. Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Keep getting handsome. <laughs> in fact, you are finer in this old age than when we started, sir. <laughs> and I do this thing the more now. Oh. Eh? Yeah, I will not sleep. I better leave me alone. Okay, now nah, shoot. Because once you start pouring encomiums on me like this, I know you want something. Shoot. Uh -uh. Why are you talking like this? So I will not praise my husband again. I am not saying you shouldn't praise me. I was actually encouraging you to praise me. But what I'm saying is that what is that thing that you want in return? Because you don't give these praises for free. I know you. Fire. Okay. Me, I won't say anything. Since you say is anytime I want something, I praise you. Uh, I want to ask you for a favor. If I, if I could go and stay with um, Noyelum in the city for a while. You know I can read you like the Bible. <laughs> You know, I've read from Genesis 
to Revelation. So there is nothing you will... In fact, before you start, I've already read you. Now tell me why. Why do you think you should go? You know, this uh, sad sadness could be contributing to her inability to get pregnant. You know, pregnancy works with psychology. Maybe if I go there, and she begins to be cheerful, there's every possibility she might be pregnant. Um, I think you're right. You're right. But I have problem with the timing. Eh? You know, this uh, troublesome Juliana is still there. And I don't want a situation whereby you go there and have face off with her. I don't want that. No. No, no, no. I'll not fight with her. I already know that she's troublesome. So I won't make any trouble with her. I will stay on my own. Why would I go and fight with a dog? I'll See? Fight. Eh? You've not gone there, you're already calling her a dog. Eh? Without your knowing, inadvertently, you can just call her one name and fighting would have started. That's what I don't want. I won't fight her. Like this. I'm very sure. Why will I fight her? Even now, though I know she's troublesome, I won't fight her. I will keep to my lane, keep to myself. I won't fight her. After I'm going to take care of my daughter, what business do I have with her? I won't fight her. It's alright, but you have to promise me that you will not stay long. I mean, leaving me here all alone, and uh, you know now, eh? Konji can disturb me now. Don't look at my age, you know, I still fire down very I will well. not stay long. That's the bottom line. I will not stay long. I won't stay long. I will come. Oh? Uh, let me leave you. It's alright. Uh, I was actually looking at uh, the teams I want to play here in my Niger belt. Arsenal versus Mayu and uh, Tottenham. I know Tottenham will beat uh, Man City. Continue. Don't worry. By the time I win, I will buy you a car. Yeah, continue, continue. Okay. Yes. Of this. What? What's the meaning of what? Why did you throw my screen form on the ground? So you have the infantry to take these rags to my washing machine. What are your hands meant for? Hmm? Points of correction. My father's washing machine, not yours. Will you shut your old fashioned for you? How dare you? How dare you talk back at me? Hmm? Now you listen. Let this be the first and last time you open your gutter of the mouth to talk back at me. What do you even take all this as for? Me? My father? This whole marriage thing? Do you think this is a movie where a step home sneaks herself into a man's house and maltreats his children? Wake up. This is me. And I won't let you maltreat me in my own father's house. Hey! Come on, go back in! Did you realize you're talking to me? Your stepmother? Huh? Yes, I do. If I don't, what will you do? What will you do? You want the game, right? Alright, we'll play the game. And this should be the very last time you stunt this rubbish again. If not, you won't be lucky next time. distance from the village to come and see you. I'm sorry, I'm 
Better. Good afternoon, Mama. Afternoon. You are welcome. Thank you. Ask one and go. Because she's going to come around. Mm. Sit. Sit. Where are your boys? Let them go and bring my bags. I came with plenty of bags. Big, big ones. So that they should be careful in bringing them. Where are they now? Mama. What is What it? are you doing with your bags? I don't understand. Oh, I have come to stay. At least to deal with those witches and wizards that have been disturbing you in your husband's house. Enough is enough. Mama, you... Where are the boys? Hey, hey! Oh, take on my I am here now. You came to, to dominate. I have come to throw you out. Ibn Amugo, what did you come to do? No problem. I don't What is the meaning of this? Why didn't your mother inform us before coming to my son's house? Point of correction! Juliana! It is in my mother's house. Look at you, wicked woman. You have come to put us under in what God has joined together already. Man and wife are one. It is not true. So she owns the house as well. Oh, this is it. This is what? You're going to the village. All the gossips are coming out now. Which gossip? You know what you're doing here. What are you doing here? So this is what you go to the village always to do. To gossip me to your mother. Send boys to go and bring my things now. So why are they wrong? You could go. Half a week in the water. I don't know about from the beginning, from the village to this place in water. In Yawa. Women die rappers. You can fend it down. So you want to come and seduce your own son? Ha! Ah, in his go. Oh, Agam. Nah, Teddy. Mama? Eh? You came? Yes, I came to see you, Papa. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Alisa, don't get it. I want to see you. I want to see you. Sit. 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 You came to marry. You say, yes, sir, yeah. Let, let's talk. Um, tell them to go and bring my things. I don't understand. Eh? Do you want to break my marriage? Eh? No. Can you just come? From... You didn't even tell me you were coming, Mama. On the contrary, I came to destroy every power that has been hindering you from conceiving and having children. Listen, you don't, you don't need to show me my room. I know my way to my room. What room is that? Mama, take it easy. What is she doing here? Mother, I'm as surprised as you are. Now tell me, what does Nayalim take this house for? A charity organization? Where they harbor the less privileged and beggars. Is that it? You know, she never told me anything about her mother coming to visit. Then she must leave this house today. Mom. You heard me very well. And listen, I don't know how possible it's going to be, but what I know is that she must leave this house today. That Katrina has totally changed from the woman you got married to. What did she do, and why did you say that? She has done nothing wrong. Just that I don't like her attitude of late. <sighs> My dear, it's okay. Don't worry, you'll be fine. You know, she just started staying with us. Okay, I just wanted to give her a little time. Just a little time. You'll be fine. Okay? I hope so. Good girl. Come on, take a seat. Take a seat. 
All the evil that you are doing today I wait to you tomorrow God is not a man that sleep no slumber He rewards every man according to their wall Why didn't your mother pre-inform you of her arrival before coming here? Same way your mother didn't pre-inform me before she came. This is my house! And I am your wife! This is also my house! I decide who stays and who leaves. Go now and tell your mother to leave my house. Your mother has to leave first. Until then, get out of my way. At once. Have you suddenly become deaf? Sorry. I've been calling you since. Sorry, Mama. I was busy upstairs. You cannot tell me, Fa. Take it. Go to the main market and buy me the, the items I listed there. I said main market, not supermarket. So quickly rush and get those things. Okay, Mama. Hey, let me just um, go freshen up. Freshen up for what? You're okay. You're looking good. You are going to the main market, not a beauty pageant. So, rush and go. All right, Mama. Mm -hmm. um, what are you looking for? Um, my cats. Oh, pa, pa, pa. my khaki. Oh, oh. <laughs> um, don't worry. Uh, you have to go to the market with a cab or taxi, not this car. Because it's making you lazy. I want you to be active, up and doing. Ah, no, Mama. Mama. Julia. What did I just hear you say? Oh, I'm sure your daughter is not dumb and deaf. She had me. Mama. Mama, stay out of this. If I pounce on you, when next your husband sees you, he will not be able to recognize you. So stay away from this. Hand me the keys. Ha! Mama, 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 don't, don't, don't. Mama, I will pass on you. Mama, I will kill you. It's okay. Mama. Shift now. Mama, I will box your breast. Mama, Get away! Mama, Mama says, Mama, what is your problem? Mama, 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 please. What? Hey! What? Give it to me, idiot. Take. Is your right? Is the car your husband gifted you? So go to the market with it. Super. Men, enjoy. Go to the market you like. Super. Men, your choice. I said men market. Listen to your mother. I get back to you. I put a monkey. Did you get back to her? Mama. What is your problem? Mama. I said go to the market. I said go to the market. Why? What is your problem? And what will you do? Eh? Why did you leave that village and come to my son's house? Don't you know that this is my son's house? This house belongs to my son. Go to your own son's house. You know, you're riding like a like a, a, a rat. You're riding. Look, you know, I don't know. Look at that turn. You did you notice that? This is equally my daughter's house. Your daughter's house. Is that what you? It, you are ashamed. You are not ashamed of yourself. Your oh. daughter's house. Why can't you stay in your husband's house? <laughs> or go to your son's house? Oh, this probably, is my son's house. Probably you had your your son out of wedlock. You don't have a husband. Meaning that what? doesn't have a house. Stay out of this. What? Ah. Oh.
What is it? Eh? I waist. The waist. I. Did you oh, fall? Mom. Eh? Oh, listen, Mom. Where have you been? Where have you been? I've been shot in your neck since. Ah. Mama, what happened? Is it not in a car? In a car, Mom. And her daughter. They almost broke my waist today. What? My waist is turning me over. My alum! My alum! Get yourself here! Why did you almost break my mother's waist? She didn't touch your mother. I did. Because she took what rightfully belonged to my daughter. So I had to take it by force. I said, my kingdom of God suffered violence. It's only the father that take it by force. Bam. So do you have any problem with that? Bam. Your days and that of your mother are numbered in this house. Ooh. I go nowhere. This is her husband's house. Yes. She belongs here. I will not go anywhere until I drag this witch you call a mother with me. Because it is obvious she is the enemy of this union. Witch! Did you hear that? Mark Only me a witch in my son's house. Mark my words. Which oh. way? Did you see the cap you're wearing? It's because a mother has been riding on your brain. That's why you're wearing cap like this. Look mm. at the house, Cap. Well, you did this to my Did mother. what? What did she do to your mother? Don't stand. Don't stand. Stay there so that your wickedness will end here. Why are you lying? Nobody touched you. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. day going? Good. Where is mommy? She's in the kitchen. Okay, tell her I'll join her shortly, okay? Okay. Let me freshen up. Okay. Good. Babe, babe, how come you're here eating rice and chicken? Why my daughter just complained that she ate noodles? What happened? You didn't give her rice? Moya said my food is not as sweet as her late mother's own. So she prefers making her food herself. When I indulged her. And why did you allow her to take such stupid decision? There will never be unity in, in, in a place, in one house like this, people are cooking differently. You're yeah, right, my husband. You're yeah, right. I'm so sorry. I just didn't want to upset her. But She used to eat your food. What happened? that question. I will do that as a good woman that I am. Really? You see, the kitchen is meant for women, mm -hmm. wives that can bear children, not men that parade themselves in women's clothes. <laughs> men that cannot bear children. Now, that was the reason I locked the kitchen though. I can see you have completely lost it. And I'm going to right now reset your brain. Hand me the keys. Now! <laughs> who is laughing with you? As who? As the woman of the house. As the man of the house. 
the one that built this house. Wait. Now last time I checked, you are just a village woman that cooks on stone and firewood. Why don't you just go out there? There are people that sell firewood in the street. Buy from them and cook. Rather than trying to belong where you are not. You know you're very stupid. When your useless son came to seek daughters and the marriage. That house you saw there. Does it look to you like the miserable village house where you're coming from? <laughs> Which house? I want me to strip you completely naked. Right here and now. <laughs> Idiot. I don't want. I don't want. Listen, I am tired of your mother's nuisance in this house. Ever since she came in, it's been from one problem to the other. What about yours? Hmm? What about yours? Do you know why this house has been relatively peaceful? Hmm? It's simply because I chose to swallow everything that your mother has been doing to me. Now that my mother is here to fight my cause, is a problem to you. Why are you, are you mad? Are you crazy? How dare you mention my mother in our conversation? Now listen and listen real good. It is either you leave or your mother leaves this house. Choose one. And that is final. Mama, again, my sweet mother, mm -hmm. I appreciate the fact that you have come to fight my cause. Oh. But the way you're going about this whole thing is wrong. I don't understand. On what side are you? When you were coming to the village, to tell me on a woman now for my whole body is paining me. I wasn't fighting your cause then. You were telling me how your husband was pummeling you, beating you, killing you. Now I have come. You're telling me the way you're going about it is the wrong way. You have not seen anything. I just started though. That drum of fight just started. Juliana and her son will dance to the tune. This whole thing is bringing a limit between me and my husband. Mm -hmm. And I don't like it. And yes, I am not the one bringing a limit between you and your husband. That way, Juliana is responsible. So hold her responsible. Then I do you. When you get me. Mama, I know you're not, you're not the one. Hey, but you have to go. You have to go back to the village. Mama, I didn't hear that. Mama, are you sending me out of your house? No. It's not me, Mama. It's my husband. Yeah. He gave me option to choose between our marriage or you leaving this house. And I still love my husband. Yeah. Go and tell him that I go nowhere. Ah. This is also my house. So I die here. Mama, you can't die here. I go nowhere. Oh. I've told you. Okay, well, I'm prepare your mind. I'm going tell him what I just said. Oh, I will start my slapping program. Maybe I stand it to you, slap him as well. Huh? Then finish the mother. Because I'd go. Mama, you, you leave me and my husband out of it. His mother, you, you can do all the slapping. But at the same time. The time, mother is still here. Has she gone? You cannot ask me to go when Juliana Obankunito is still here. Oba say, I go nowhere. I die here. Mama, please, you will not die here. Eh? I, do you want me to enjoy this marriage? Are you enjoying the marriage now? Do you want to send, send me out? They sent you. Who is sending you anywhere? I am here. <laughs> hey, one person, a team. I'm a team. Just single handedly, I'm a team. I know, I know you're a So team. be ready. Yeah. I am going nowhere. Mama, I go nowhere. Mama, please. Okay. I don't go anywhere. Why? I don't go anywhere. I don't go anywhere. Why am I not here? Because I'm not here. Learn to accept it. I go nowhere. <sighs> Who are you afraid of? I'm not afraid of anybody. You are not afraid of anybody. Tell me who you are afraid of. Let me go and handle the person myself. I know you. You can handle anything. Uh -huh. So calm down. I'm here. Huh. If they ask you 
to tell me to go, tell them to come and tell me themselves. Nay, since my mother came to the house, there is no doubt that past that she doesn't fight my mother anymore. They fight, they quarrel every day. I am tired. Honestly, I'm tired. You see, your mother, she is my kind of woman. My very kind of woman. No nonsense person. If you are like her, I am pretty sure your mother-in-law will not have the infantry to come to your house to cause quarrel and trouble. No. She wouldn't dare. The issue now is that she has refused to go. I need her to leave my house. So there will be peace. Honestly. Why? Why do you want her to leave? <sighs> she is there to help you fight your fight. My husband. My husband gave me an option to choose between our marriage and my mother. I see why she needs to go. Because I don't want to leave my marriage. No matter what, I don't want to leave. I still love my husband. Mm. Why is he forcing your mother to leave? Is he also forcing his own mother to leave that way? Why is your mother's presence a problem to him? Why? I don't know. But what matters to me now is to do something, anything, whatsoever that can make that woman to go. Let her just leave my house. I don't want to just make my husband angry anymore. Uh, now you sad me, I beg. Somebody came to help you fight and you want the person to leave. Are you sad you? Anyway, you know I complained you've not been dressing and looking good. Have you tried to order for the things I asked you to order for? Nice hairs and nice outfits. Hairs, outfits. Hm. That is the least of my problem right now. Okay. So you don't want to look hot? I don't know, understand. Kill. Let's, uh, let's go. Huh? Don't worry. I don't even know what to tell you, but you say everything will be fine. Uh, no, yeah. Good morning. How are you? Papa, I'm not fine. I'm not fine at all. You're not fine? Even with your mother with you there? Papa, she is the cause of my problem. She is. Eh? Since she came, there is no day that she doesn't quarrel with my mother-in-law. And the whole thing is bringing problem between me and my husband. I knew it. I knew when she was leaving that she was going to make trouble there. Huh? Papa, please, just come and carry her. Come and carry your wife home, please. I tried to see whether she can leave, but I couldn't do it. She refused to go. Papa, please come. I don't want to bring my, my marriage anymore. Please, Papa. No, you don't worry, okay? Don't worry. I'll take care of things. All right? Don't worry. Bye. <laughs> Ginika. Ginika. I knew she was going to make trouble. Hey! I have to leave uh, the village very early this morning so that I can get your time. Thank you for coming, Papa. Thank you. Okay, so where is your mother? Ah, she's inside. Me. What so, um, is going on here? Ah. Young man, when you see an elder in the morning, what is the ideal thing to do? Well, that is when they are welcomed. Noyalum. Have you turned my house to the home of the homeless? Baby! Or have you brought your father here to come and fight me? Excuse me? Dad. Homeless? Yes, homeless. Excuse me. Honey, what is wrong with you? What nonsense? Who is here to stay anyway? How 
I won't live in this kind of environment. Is this what you've been passing through? It's okay. It's okay. Moi, homeless. Papa, it's okay. Please. Please. Hey. Don't be angry, Papa. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm out of this place. Okay, Papa. What nonsense? Let, let me take you to where my mind is. Just, just follow me. Come, come, come. Please, Papa. Papa, it's okay. Come. Oh, come. Genica, I know you did what you did because of the love you have for her daughter. But you must know that not every war is won with sword and spears. Okay? I don't have spares, neither do I have salt. The one I have, I used it well. As yes, you have said, I must return back to the village. No problem. But I will go with my daughter. I cannot afford to leave Nonyelum in the hands of uh, Juliana, her wicked son. They will kill her for me. Really? She's the only one I have. Just her and her brother. And we're only also. <laughs> Look. Noye has been living in this house for years. Mm, I've been suffering. All by herself without us. Right? Noye that I know. If things get worse, she will come home by herself. Okay? So, my decision is this. First thing tomorrow morning, we are going back to the village. I say it's okay. It's okay. Take, 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 take. We are going to the village. Going on, how come you pack the whole salt in the whole universe and then put it inside the thrice? Salt? Salt! Unu, unu, salt! It's too much! Dad, you can take from mine. Just that she doesn't know how to cook. Hmm. Who made this? Me. My little one taught me how to cook. When? How? You're always at work. You did this? Yes. Oh my god. This is wonderful. Ah. Huh? It's okay. Just continue, okay? Mm -mm. Don't worry. It's okay, it's okay. When you when you're done with this, go and prepare my own. Okay. Yeah. Right. Don't mind.
find that. She doesn't know how to cook. Catherine, where are you? You're starting darling, darling. Which of them? What are you talking about? What I'm saying is that Chimonya is the reason my food is salty. What? Yes. When I finished making that food, I tasted it. It was perfect. All oh, come upstairs, you had my butt and go down to dish the food, it became salty. And she was dead a set time. Can you listen to yourself? Huh? Just see how ridiculous you're sounding. Why do you always exempt yourself from blames, lying against a little girl for what she did not do? Is that, is that not funny? So, what you're trying to say is that you're going to sit down here and do nothing instead of going to figure out the truth, right? You know what? I just had a very wonderful meal. A very subnoxious meal. I want it to enter my body. Okay? I don't need this stress from you, please. I don't just need this, okay? <clears throat> oh my god. Silent no be wickedness. To bomb my book, he malaba. Sooner but in night. Sooner to this no be size. Silent no be wickedness. To bomb my book, he malaba. Sooner but in night. Sooner to this no be size. Silent no be wickedness. To bomb my book, he malaba. Sooner but in night. Sooner to this no be size. Silent no be wickedness. To bomb my book, he malaba. Bobby, 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 a chair of one so blue. Little Bobby, a native Bobby, 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 a chair of one so blue. A native Bolaway, an Indian Sabu, a Yaki Sabu, a Tayabu, a Baby Faya Canodo, a Taga, Bobby, one, Vanta, Vanit to one Sabu, a Yaki Sabu, a Tayabu, a Baby Faya. She's wise and brave. Don't take her for granted. Dinika, what is it with the long face? Did you really ask that? Are you seriously asking me that? When you made me leave my daughter in the lion's den to face her fate alone, uh -huh. you are asking me that. You want me to be happy? Thank you. Thank you, you said it's her fate. The fate is her own, not your own. So let her suffer that fate all by herself. So why are you worrying yourself? Huh? Akachi, last one. Why did you bring me back to this village? What am I doing for you? Exactly what we have just said. Fate. If that marriage wants to die, let it die naturally. You shouldn't be the one to kill it. Huh? So I brought you here so that nobody will hold you responsible for anything that will happen to that marriage. I beg you. Uh, oh yeah, come now, let's carry these things. I'm not carrying the bag. Carry it. You brought me all the way from the city where I was taking care of my daughter. Come and carry the bag for you. Carry the bag. You wanted to come back to the village. You are in the village and I carry your bag. It's your responsibility. And you are shouting at me. Come and carry this bag. I'm not carry it. <laughs> Look at this woman, oh. Okay, I will not carry also. What is it? I will not carry. Leave it there. Leave it. Who, who, who is that shame? Is it not in front of your house? You see women? If I don't carry this bag now, they will say I'm not pampering my wife. 
Even though that I love you, eh? Okay. This will serve you. Ginnika! Ginnika! Soaked my screen in foam. Mm -hmm. I'm the one. So you feel you can embarrass me in the presence of my husband and go scot free? Huh? No way. I did it. Just wait until your father comes down and ask you why you are not dressed in your school uniform yet. Then, I would tell him that you were playing your life out yesterday and forgot you soaked your uniform. And then watch him give you the beating of your life this morning. <laughs> Sorry to bust your bubble, Mrs. Darkheart. Today is public holiday in our school. So thank you so much for soaking my school uniform. What? You just shot yourself on the foot. Bond. Bond? How did it happen? I was trying to use my wipes on my face. And then I started feeling hot on my face. I ran inside the bathroom and this happened. Uh, oh babe, come on, you know. You need to be careful how you use all this all, all, all this product. Mm -mm. I need to be careful of your daughter. I I don't understand. What do you mean? She's the one who put whatever she put in my wipes that cost me this thing on my face. See, why must you say an outrageous thing like this? Huh? Must you involve her in all your misfortune? Just look at my face. Just, 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 just take a look at my face. Oh, what she's done to my face? No problem. This is the height of it. She's going to hear me this time. human being, okay? Huh? You daughter of a witch. What have you done to my face? If there is anyone to come with me, that person should be you. Because you look like one that just escaped from hell. Well, but have you looked at yourself in the mirror today? You know you will not get away with this one, right? Because of all the things you've done to me, this one talks the chat. Ruining my beauty, you will not get away with it. What will you do? What will you do? You said you want a game. Let's play it. 
But it seems I'm winning. Watch your back, little brat. I don't care. <laughs> Jesus. Ah, what happened to your face? My stepdaughter happened. Uh -uh. Chiwanya. Mm -hmm. She did this to you? I don't understand. She put something in my wipes. When I tried to wipe my face with it, this happened. Hello, why would she do such a thing to you? Why? Forget about that me. For what? Please, I don't want to talk about it. As you're seeing me here, my face is so is so hot. I feel like they are roasting plantain on my face. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Sorry, pardon my man. <laughs> pardon my manners, please. It was at the bones. It looks so good on you. <laughs> You're not serious. You're not just serious. Sorry. I'm just, sorry. Just joking. That's all I know you're bad in guessing. Well, I was feeling feverish today and decided to go to the hospital. And what did they tell you that is wrong with you? <clears throat> I'm two weeks pregnant. <laughs> you are pregnant? Mm -hmm. So you're trying to tell me that little Nicholas is growing in this womb of yours. How do you know he's going to be a boy? Of course he's a boy. He is a boy, I know already. Henceforth, I do not want you to be doing anything in this house again. Leave everything for me. Hmm. For a pregnancy that's just two weeks old. Yes, it doesn't matter. What matters is that I do not want you to do anything again. <laughs> Leave everything for me, okay? In fact, I'm going to prepare something special for you right now. <laughs> I'm coming to join you. No. I will no. assist. Mm -mm. I said no. I said no. I'm going to relax while I go there, get you something special. Come <laughs> Don't go anywhere. <laughs> this is sweet. <laughs> hey, brother, what was it I want to talk to you about that you don't do on the phone? Yes. Really? Ah, I forgot that you're so terrible in guessing. Exactly. So tell me. My wife is too is pregnant. <laughs> I'm so happy for both of you. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. It's okay, I understand. I'm optimistic that someday God will give you your own child. And that will be soonest. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for everything. <laughs> um, today is a happy day. It's not a sad day. So let me just be happy. It's fine. It's fine. Yes. So, where is she? She's upstairs sleeping. You know, I asked her not to stress herself. Mm -hmm. She'll just be there, <laughs> relax, <laughs> and eat. So to be the hottest dad in town. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's so funny, but it's all good. It's yeah. all good. Um, what about Chimoya? She's not back from school yet. Okay. okay. Uh, I think this calls for celebration. Okay? 
Let me get your favorite wine. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Hurry up. Yeah, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. One day, what is even wrong with you? Eh? You pop on, Jen? Daddy, I don't understand. I'm confused. You're confused? Eh? Of all the worst things you've done to, to, to my wife, your stepmother, the worst part of them is dropping banana pills on the staircase for her to match it, either die, break her hands, or lose the baby. But finally, she has lost the baby. You succeeded. Hmm? You succeeded. I was telling you that this girl is a witch who's been doing everything possible to frustrate me out of this house. You didn't believe me, oh. You didn't believe me. And look at me. Look at me, oh. She has succeeded in taking my baby away. Hey! Daddy, I can explain. Explain what? What do you want to explain? Do you know the gravity of what you did? Do you know? Eh? Oto banana. Ulysia, to sort of step. Oh yeah. See, you're going to go out of that gate, kneel down there. By the time the scorching sun finished dealing with your skin, eh? You have respect. Oh, yeah. Go. outside here and look for you, eh? You will never return to this house again. You have to be there, kneel down, hands up. No, I so whenever I want you to come back, open that gate. No, 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 open that gate. No, 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 no. I'll slap you now. Open that gate. Now. 
What did you do? Please, nobody did. There is fire on the mountain. Run, run, run. I don't know what in um uh 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 Yes! And I know, I know say, uh, 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 in wife, that just bell, uh, her hand dead here. Uh, her hand dead here. No, hold on, hold on. Why didn't you call me earlier? I did wait to. I did think, say, Oga go forgive in Peking. Uh, tell me, say, make I go open the gate for her. Uh, 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 that uh, 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 But till now, he never forgive him. And the Peking is still there outside, though. Outside the gate! Yeah? By this time of the night! Listen, listen. Look for something to give her to cover herself from cold, okay? Just let her cover herself, I'm coming. Oh, one of them. I've already given her the clothes to cover her body. Eh? I gave her a papa. May she take cover body. You forget. Make her no come kill you, you will be careful. That was Okay, okay. I'm coming right away. Just. Uh, hold, I'm coming right away. Please, hold on. <laughs> of your house or oh, instead you can take me to the village i'll go and stay with grandma and grandpa uh -uh. i will not throw you out i promise okay so tell me exactly what happened okay my dad accused me of putting banana peels on the stairs that made my my stepmother to sleep and she lost her pregnancy. Ah, ah. Chimoya, that was bad. Very bad. Catherine told me that you've been pulling some thumbs against her lately. So I wanted to just tell me the gospel truth. Tell me how everything happened. Okay? I know. I've done all that. Just that the thing what happened yesterday is that she... What is going on here? Nicholas accused her of what she didn't do and sent her out of the house. Can you imagine? By this time of the night. Eh? So, you as the head of the house, as the head of the family, 
decided to bring her here. You know it's a thing of concern to me that you have been bringing people to my house on a daily basis without my consent. I don't understand. This was urgent. I couldn't leave her out there in the dark. I just had to bring her home. Okay? Look, let me tell you. It is either she leaves my house this minute or you leave with her. You expect me to leave her out there in the dark by this time of the night. My brother's daughter, my niece. Now it is confirmed to me that you are not just heartless, but you have no heart at all. You have no heart. Be sure to shut the door after you. Olisa. Olisa. My daughter, where, where is my daughter? She's still outside serving the punishment you gave her. Oh my god. How can I possibly leave my daughter outside by this time? Past 11 pm. She's just serving her punishment. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where's my daughter? I don't know. What do you mean by you don't know? Hey. Eh? How could you lock my daughter outside the gate? Hey, me! Hey, hey, hey! Do not care. I will move here. Have you seen it? My village people. Where's my daughter? You're talking rubbish. Okay, maybe you lock the gate. I say, make I not open the gate. So if I open up, you can send me come out. Huh? Hey! You mean? Oh. Hey. Is it? She's not there? Hey! So you're here sleeping. You still have the mind to sleep while my daughter is missing. Catherine, I'm talking to you. Catherine. Catherine. So you still have the mind to sleep while my daughter is missing. Why won't I sleep? Why won't Sorry. She just said missing. Yes. I went outside to search for her. She's nowhere to be found. Is that why you're bothering yourself? She's probably gone to one of her boyfriend's house. Hey, my friend, would you just shut that stupid mouth of yours if you don't have anything to say? Since I have nothing to say, please, allow me sleep. Oh, just interrupting my sleep now. Oh, 
Now let me hug my granddaughter. Ah, ah. Ah, how are you? I'm fine, Grandpa. What a pleasant surprise. Eh? It's been a while your father brought you to see us here in the village. Sit with me, oh. Grandchild, I'm a poker. You have grown so much. In fact, eh, very soon I'll be buying you big, big clothes. <laughs> your daddy Nicholas and your new mommy, they are taking good care of you. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> now, talking about uh, Nicholas, where is he? Uh, Papa, it's a long story. Chimanya will explain everything to you. Mama, explain now. Uh, Mama, huh? I have to be on my way now. I have, um, I have scores settled with my husband in the city. Scores what? Can you go and tell scores? Well, whatever it is, Nico, be careful. Okay? Aha. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Careful, woman. Oh, what will be? Everything will be fine. Oh, Chimaya, I will miss you. But don't worry, Grandma is here. Okay? So promise me that you're going to take good care of yourself. Deal. Deal. <laughs> Auntie, the love you showed me, I can't take it for granted. You even went by ways by sleeping outside your matrimonial home just because of me. It's okay. On this day, I pray to the heavens to go out of their ways to grant your heart desires by giving you the fruit of the womb. Amen. 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 So, this so you'll be respected like the other wives. Amen. 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 Thank you. Hey! God, Thank answer you. this prayer because. My sunshine. I'll miss you too. Hmm? Don't cry. Hmm? Don't cry. Grandma is here. And grandpa too. Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Papa, I'll be on my way now. So, Mama, mm -hmm. please, I'll see you soon. One, one, one. Okay, go, go. Oh. I can't keep you keep Oh, oh jealous. <laughs> I can't be jealous of my sweetheart. What My heart is for him to send you out of the dark. What if something bad had happened to you? You see, what I don't know really understand here is uh, Catherine's disposition towards this. I mean, what, what did she do 
about this? How, how could she have allowed Nicholas to treat his own daughter like this? Eh? Suppose she were to be her daughter. Would she have allowed Nicholas to treat her like that? She must be a very wicked woman. Hey! I will teach that Jessica the lesson of her life. So all this while she was pretending so that my son will marry her. As soon as he got married to her and she came into this family, she changed. No problem. She has not heard the last of this. Madoya vam vam vam! I know what to do. I know what to do. I will invite Nicholas to this house. And he will explain why he has to treat his own daughter in such a sinister manner. Eh? Just because of a child that is still in the womb. A child that we, we are not even you know, sure whether the fetus will, will develop into a, a, a human being. I, am a woman, I, am eh? I, am a I don't want to go back to him. I want to stay with grandma. <laughs> Um, he's your father, okay? He deserves a second chance. Oh no, nah. But don't worry, okay? Uh, let's see how things unravel. Hmm? I miss my mom right now. If she was here, all this would not happen. I know, but you have me. I am here, I'll protect you. You'll be fine. I won't let anyone hurt you again. I'll take care of you. Sister, uh, brother, you're have, you, have you seen my daughter? Sit down. I don't, have you seen my daughter? Brother, sit down first. Sit down. I, I've not seen her. Sit down. What happened? You know, I, 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 don't, I don't just know my daughter's whereabouts. I don't understand what you're talking about. Yes, this is something that got me pissed. Then I sent her out of the house. Going out there to look for her, I, I couldn't just find her. But were you drunk? Have you ever heard that the best way to punish a child is to send him or her out of the house? What are you talking about, brother? Please, I, I, I wasn't just thinking straight. Please, just help me out here. Help me out. I, I, don't, I don't want to lose my daughter, please. Brother, listen to me. If anything happens to my niece, anything at all, brother, I will never, ever forgive you. Never. Get off of my couch. I'm going for you. Get off of my couch. I'm not thinking you. So, how, how do you imagine? My dear, I am finished. I am finished. What is it? My sister does not know my, 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 my daughter's whereabouts. Is that why you're paranoid? So, this is not enough reason for me to feel bad or something. Well, before you came in, was. Uh, Watching TV. If I put in a chapter, let you need I love Big bro. I wait till you tomorrow. God is not a man that sleeps no slumber. He was every man according to their walk.
with you. Hmm? How could you be so wicked and insensitive to have allowed your husband to send his only daughter out of the house? To her sake, how could you? It's obvious you've listened to gossips and you've believed them before hearing my own side of the story. I don't care about your own path of this story. I do not care because there is nothing that will make a father send his little girl out of the house. You were there and you did nothing. I lost my pregnancy. Anyway, I did not expect you to understand the feeling of losing a child. <laughs> You've never had a single miscarriage. You heard me. Instead of you to devise a means to fix your marriage and get pregnant, you brought your empty self here, meddling into other people's marital affairs. Katia, you said all this to me. You, you said all this to me. After you have schemed your way into my brother's house, uh, you think you will have the last love. You will not. I bet you, my darling, you will not. Are you done talking? I mean, are you done making noise in another woman's house? Are you done? Take your empty self out of my house. I am not making noise. One thing is for sure. I will be back. I promise you that. I will be back. I will be back. I will be back. Yet you don't care, you don't know what you have. You use your fake life to destroy yourself. Nobody is gone, all this evil is in vain. How long you can pretend no God is watching? Nobody is gone, all this evil is in vain. Hmm? Good. Papa? Mama? Good morning. Papa, you said you wanted us to talk. Your daughter told us everything that happened in your house. I mean, how could you? How could you chase your only daughter out of your house? You didn't just chase her out, you left her out till night. If not for your sister Noye that came to her rescue, she would have slept outside. How could you be this callous? Huh? But my letter came out that night, but I couldn't find her. Will you shut your mouth. Shut that mouth. That gutter you call a mouth. If your father and I had raised you like that, would it be where you are today? Talking this nonsense. When I came out and you didn't see her. I want you to see her. What did you do? You know that wouldn't whine. Uh, uh, Nicholas. Your daughter is bereaved. She is a baby. She lost the mother. Right now, she needs all the love that she can get. Mm -hmm. You don't have to treat her like this. Papa, Mama, I am so sorry for everything. I'm really, 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 really sorry. Okay? Uh, trust me, it won't happen again. Uh, at least, can I now take her home and write 
my wrongs. Mba, that will not be possible now. Yes. yes, it cannot. Because the fact that your wife was there, she encouraged you to do what you did, it means something is wrong with that woman. And we must take care of that first. There's a problem. So you can't do that now. It's okay. I'll go back to the city and bring her here first thing tomorrow morning. Better. Which tomorrow? Which is better? Go now. You are not staying in my house till tomorrow. Go now. Go and bring her. My dear. Just leave her. Go. My daughter. Where? Uh, how? She's right there in the village with my parents. In the village? Yeah. How did she get there and why didn't she come back with her? My Elam took her there. But my parents refused to release her to me. They said until we talk. Me inclusive? Yeah. Is that any of my business? Huh? Instead of them to release her to us so she can face more disciplinary measures, they are holding her back. Anyway, I'm not going anywhere until I have a chance to go to that village. And what will you be doing that makes you to be chanced? Huh? Hey, listen, listen. We are leaving for the village first thing tomorrow morning. Do you understand? And that is final. I'm not going anywhere. We summoned this meeting because of the incident that happened a few days ago. We called you here to know the reason you supported Nicholas in throwing Chimwanya here out of the house. As a woman and as a wife, you should be clamoring for unity and love in your family and not tearing your own house down. Are you guys being serious right now? Oh, guy. No, are you being serious? Nobody is talking about the loss of my pregnancy. All you are concerned about is Chimoya here, saying that I threw her out. I don't even throw her out. It's Nicholas who did. Uh, Catherine, we sympathize with you over the loss of your unborn child. So we are not just blaming you solely for what happened. As a matter of fact, Nicholas is in this meeting because he's also to be blamed. Okay? You sympathize with me. It does not seem to me as though you do. Because all you are concerned about is your grandchild. For, uh, forgetting that, my unborn child would have, would have as well been your grandchild. Dear Catherine, we didn't invite you here to banter words with us. We called you here to talk to you, so listen to us. But I have freedom of speech. So let me talk. You people are not being fair here. You're not. I've been partial. Hey, hey, my friend, just shut up. Mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't shut me up. 
do not shut me up. Instead of you to caution Chimoya here for pulling that useless stunt, you all are seated here vomiting rubbish. What? The green snake in the green grass has finally shown herself. Papa, Mama, you've seen it. Mama, for what? Shut up, you rats. Nicholas, take me home. The meeting is not over yet, so you're not going anywhere. Do you understand? I do not have any other thing to say here. You know what? I'll board a taxi. Meet me at home. Catherine, sit down. Catherine. Hey! Hey! Nicholas. Oh, you enough? You see it? Everyone has seen it. Chai. Nicholas, you are completely finished. Have you been coping with this nonsense? Hi! And what's the meaning of that rubbish? Meaning of what exactly? You're asking me? Why must you talk to my parents like that? How did I talk to them? I only told them the truth. But you know, like they say, truth is bitter. But you have to accept it whether they like it or not. I, I, are, you, are, you, are you mad? Are you crazy? Hey. Hey. If your parents did not give you home training, I am going to give you home training here. Because. your mother's constant ill treatment in this house. She must leave. What? My mother is gone. You wanted her to go. Now she's gone. Your mother must go. She must leave. I can see that um, there is something wrong with your head. I can see that you are mad. Who are you even married to? Me or your mother. She cooks for you. She wash your clothes. You even take her out. What is remaining is for you to lay with her. That is what is left. That is what is left. I will pretend I did not just hear that nonsense you just vomited from your mouth. Lisa, you heard me. You heard me loud and clear. I am tired. Oh, Lisa, I am tired. Give me. Give me if you must. But this, this is not life. I'm tired of this life. I am tired. She has to go. Can't you see? She, she has to go. When your tears and cry no you have been tired of the world Just for a night But joy will make it in you In the morning Oh dear, my mother My heart is feeling Oh, oh, oh If anybody had told me that Catherine is this wicked, honestly, I wouldn't have believed it. No wonder she has been pretending all this while just so she can get into my son's life. But let me tell you, it is not late yet. Because she can easily be kicked out of his life. Hi! Hi. Hey. Hey. Is it not in the book of Zachariah or no, Jeremiah? Ah. How do you know what I want to say? You want to say the heart of man is desperately wicked. Exactly. Oh, the heart of man is wicked desperately. And no, no who can know it. Ha! Oh, look, that woman, that woman. 
Hey, she doesn't want to see my wrath. Oh. She doesn't want to see my wrath. If she does anything that is synonymous with what she did again, oh, what I will do to her, eh? She will know that there is difference between six and half a dozen. My husband, don't bother your head. It won't happen again. I am happy Chimwanya is here with us. I should not go back there until further notice. I will not agree. Um, uh, Ginika. Nicholas is her father. Mm. Hmm? As soon as we overcome this impasse. I mean, he should be free to come and take his daughter. Until then. But as for Catherine, as for Catherine, hey! Hmm. Why are you going to If you're not going to be a man, if you're not going to be a man, you're not going to be a man. Hey! Okay. Like All right. Odemba. If I tell you what I heard from Mazia Kachi's compound yesterday, you'll be shocked. What is it? And how did you hear it? You know we said the same things. Yes. So I heard everything they discussed from my house. They said that Nicholas' new wife is very wicked. But she pretended to be nice just to marry him. That's not all though. That's not all though. They also said that she threw Nicholas' only daughter at night to die. You don't mean they invited her but she insulted all of them and walked away. <laughs> Are you sure of all these things you're saying? I'm sure now. Why are you saying this? I think Nicholas is so unlucky. First, his wife died. Now, the second wife he got married to is giving him issue. A wife he got married to not very three months ago. He's not unlucky. Hmm? He's cursed. No, no. Ah, what, what, what is no now? Eh? Are you not seeing it? Ha! Don't be saying such about Nicholas. Wait, thank God I did not marry him. Eh? If not, I would have been the one dead by now. Imagine me throwing myself at Nicholas when he's still young in this village. Eh? But he left me, a home me, Kambili. Can't you see? He left me and married a city woman. Imagine that now. Stop saying that. Nicholas is not cursed. He's a good man. He's just been so unlucky with women. That's all. Eh? Just believe what you want. What is the truth now? Ridiculous. What can I possibly want from a cost girl like you? Can't believe. Eh, 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 eh. Don't tell me to stop. Don't tell me to stop, please. And the answer to your question. My name is Kambili, a beautiful maiden of this village who loved your father so very much. Not until he left me and married a city woman, your mother. But I thank God I didn't marry him. If not, I would have been the one dead by now. Whatever you had with my father in the past is none of my business and you don't have any right to bring my mother into it. And if I do, what will you do? Eh? Tell me, what will you do, you daughter of a cursed father? Miss Blessed, you are still unmarried and you're wambling around this village with poverty. How dare you? Eh? <sighs> Don't you ever stop me in the road to say this rubbish. If not, you will hear from me. <sighs> Did you hear what that rat when said? I told Jesus you to Christ. leave her alone, didn't I warn you? I warned you. A girl that you knew when they gave birth to. She should watch her back. Where would I go and look for this girl now? Eh? With her color that is shining everywhere. She can easily be spotted. And when they carry her, where would I go and look for her? Have you seen my life? Chemwanya! Hey! Oh, Coco! Mwanya! She like me! Where have you been? I've been wondering about you. Where did you go? I 
went to see around the village. You were sleeping, so I decided not to disturb you. You went to see around the village? Yes, Grandma. Nevertheless, you should have told me. But you were sleeping. You could have suddenly woken me up to tell me you were leaving I the house. I to disturb you. Come, please don't do that again. Okay. You got me so worried. I'm sorry, Grandma. It's okay. Did, did you make any new friend? No. Enemy. Enemy, come. Who is the enemy? Her name is Kambili. Kambili? Okay, now! Did she do anything to you? No, Grandma. She is indeed our enemy. Enemy to this family, especially to you and your father. Just because your father refused to marry her. That is why she's tormenting our lives. Don't go near her. And don't let her come near you either. Alright? Okay, Grandma. Did, did she do anything to you? She did not. Oh, you go inside and carry your food on the table. Okay, oh? It's what somebody used to play with me or my man. Where is Kambili? I got the Ekwenka. It wasn't my fault she wasn't married. She wanted my son to marry her. My son refused. How is it our fault? Look at who she's trying to make trouble with. Mom, the person that uh, she was struggling the man with is dead. Why can't she die and leave the girl alone to live her life? Touch my child. Agadi, Agadi now go fair. Terrorist. Look at my, this one God just gave me, this one. Man. I wonder why Noyalome is hell bent on sending you out of this house. What else? What else if not for the fact that she knows that I am the one that will see through her and knows that she is devilish. Mother, she desperately wants you to leave the house. I think it's time. Time for what? Time to bring in another woman who bears a more fertile ground where your seed can sprout. Mother, do you think this is the right time? Hello, Cassie baby. How are you doing? My dear, I'm fine. No, oh. I'm fine. How is everything? Okay, uh, is my brother there? I've been trying to call him, but he's not picking up. Oh, he has gone out. Hmm, is all right? You're enjoying yourself. You're enjoying my brother's money. <laughs> Shop the money. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Uh, I will come see you, but not now. Please, not now. I'm just relaxing. Please, don't stress me at all. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> okay, I'll come see you soon. <laughs> I'm just relaxing. Eh? So you are here? You think you will turn my son against me? Eh? You think my son will listen to you? Just look at you. You this shameless, worthless, useless, foolish, shameless, bad woman. Eh? Oh, you told my son to send me back in from his own house, his mother. Let me bust your bubble. Look, my son have now decided to do that, which he was supposed to do a long time ago. He shocked you. Eh? Which is? Ha! Ah. <laughs> no need of telling you. You just wait and see. Fruitless vacuum. Net weight. Local auction. Look at her. Just watch me. You will see. What is will happen? Eh? You will not have the mouth to say what you will say. I know of you. Oh dear, Mama Gama, my heart is pulling me. Oh. Oh. Your content. 
Jenna has landed, as you can see, direct from the village. <laughs> you look great. I I'm done for the Rafuma. I can see. So, um, what's your name? My own my God. Oh my God. Uh, Alpha Mubo is my name, Fido. And she's from the same village with us. <laughs> so, what's your academic qualification? Mama, what is she doing? Oh, um, don't mind her. <laughs> she likes being funny. So, are you a university graduate? <laughs> Chineke, ma, nga na bako ko, nke ere jele, ore jele. Mother, what's going on? Is she okay? Ah, uh -uh, don't mind her. She's funny and she's here to make us happy, in as well as she will do the other one. Nga ma, ole ene roko. She's funny. She's here to entertain us. What is going on here? My husband. Who is she and what, what is she doing here? Mama, what is happening here? What is happening? Wait, are you expecting me to answer that? Yes, we all know you are a parent, but blind? Ah. You can see what is going on here that we are enjoying. Eh? Nem. Cheers. <laughs> and how it goes. Oh. My husband. My love. Please talk to me. My husband, please. What, what is happening? What, what is going on here? Eh? Hmm. Ah, leave him alone. Eh? Why are you disturbing him? Can't you see someone is beside him? Ah. Now, would you like to join us? Oh. Ah. <laughs> Cook for me. <laughs> ah, that is it. <laughs> um, um, can you can you sit up? Yeah. Sit up here. Thank you. Yeah, that's um, Baho Bali. Bao Bao. Baho Bali. <laughs> That's an electric flame. It's like the frame of an electric flame. Um, Mama, are you sure this is going to work? My son, you have to relax. Eh? Everything is going to be well. The most important is the other one. If you look well, she will give us what we want. Am I not tired? What was the meaning of that straight you just put up back there? What was it? 
That lady's name is Philomena. And she is my new wife that would bear me children. Look at you. Take a good look at yourself. You brought that local thing to replace me. How? How? At least she is a real woman. Unlike you, my fellow man in a woman's skin. What have I done to deserve this from you? My love, what have I done? I have given you everything. I have endured everything just because of the love I have for you. I am not God that gives children. He will give us our own when the time comes. Please. When is the time? For how long am I going to wait for a seed to sprout on a rocky ground you call womb? For how long? You know what? I am tired. I just came back from the market. I don't have strength for this. Let me just change it to something. my clothes. That reminds me. I have moved your filthy properties to the guest room. That is where you will be operating from now henceforth. And if you do not behave yourself, I will throw you out of my house. Stop crying. Stop with me. 
this can only make you stronger Stronger Kasa rachine kegi kasi ni bona Oli samaka Weko Mama Good morning Good morning Wait, don't tell me you slept here last night and you left your wife all alone in your room. What happened to your room? Which wife? Mama, that thing you brought to me had the temerity to use my duvet to wipe her kata. Imagine messing my best friend up with her flu. She did what? The worst part of this whole thing is that she snores like a pig. I couldn't even sleep for a second. Um, you have to calm down, my son. Eh? Calm down. I will go and speak to her. Mama, okay? Mama, this thing is not going to work. I'm telling you. You see this thing, this arrangement is not working. Uh, my son, don't you trust your mother again? Don't you trust me? You have to listen to me. See, the most important of all is for her to conceive. Let her conceive. Give us children. Uh -huh. All that things are uh, doesn't matter. That's the most important. To give us kids. To give us children. Eh? Don't worry. Let me go and talk to her. Don't worry. You have nothing to worry. Ever since she came into the house, it's been serious body odor everywhere. Everywhere stinks. Don't worry. Eh? I will buy roll-on for her. Eh, eh, I will buy roll-on and I will buy perfumes for her. We will package her. Let her just give us what we want. It's so bad. Oh. Chosen to destroy the part I set for you for my son to marry you. Why? <coughs> Mama, what I do again? Just look at you. You are cleaning your nose with a duvet and a pillow. It's not handkerchief. Another thing. Look at the way you were snoring. <sighs> huh? What was that? You have to reduce the way you snore. Your husband is not happy with you. He's very angry. Mama, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You have to say that to your husband, not to me. Listen very well. You have to go to him. Tell him, I am sorry. I will not repeat what I did last night. I, 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 sorry. I repeat what I did last night. Is that what I said? Listen, I said, I am sorry. I will not repeat what I did last night. I, 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 sorry. I'll repeat what I, what I did, what I did last night. What I did last night, I repeat. I, 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 sorry. I, 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 sorry. Yes. 
I repeat what I did last night. What are you doing here? Eh? Have you come to mess up my couch with your dirty stinking flu? Uh, uh, I, I sorry. Hmm? I sorry. I, I will do what I did last night again. I sorry. I do last night again. I did. Huh? But Mama said, Mama said, I will do what I did last night again. I sorry, my husband, me. the meaning of this? <coughs> Why are you making food on the dining table? <coughs> I'm asking you, what happened to the kitchen? I can't cook you there. I'll cook you here. It is you that will cook there. What is wrong with you? Can't you see the whole house is smelling? What is wrong with you? What kind of bacteria are you spreading in the in the in the whole food that you're supposed to make? What is the meaning of this? Look, a pot on the dining table. Oh Lord, God, no, this is not happening. Mama, will you take this whole nonsense to the kitchen? Mama, oh, Mama, oh, Mama, where are you? Huh? Cook you here, cook you here, cook you here, cook you here. I don't cook you here, I cook you here. You here, you enter where? Here, I don't cook you there. Eat, 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 you go kill me there. Husband, food is ready. Food on land. Um, no, let's go and eat. Mama. May God forbid that I eat anything prepared from that kitchen. That's too harsh. Coming from, as in for your wife to be. It's too harsh. Ask her how she cooked the food. I saw this local breed eating her breast and her buttocks and, 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 and her armpits. And she did not even bother to go wash her hands. Mama, she was busy sneezing into the vegetable that she was going to use to prepare food for me to eat. Don't tell me that. That's what you want me to eat? Yes. Of Will course. you shut up? Shut up, you're saying yes, yes, yes. Um, my son, please. You're looking for who to kill. It's not me. Yes, sir. Yes to you too. Hi. Just, just look at me. No. Uh, I, 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 sorry. Eh? I, sorry. Uh, I will do what I did last night again. Miss <laughs> Lamely! Shut up! Um, my son, please, don't worry. Don't disturb yourself. Let me quickly rush to the kitchen and prepare something better for you to oh. eat, okay? Mother, you don't understand. 
I am not going to eat any meal prepared in this kitchen until I call the fumigation company to come and fumigate the kitchen and the entire house of bacterial infection. Exactly. I am going to eat outside. There is a very beautiful restaurant down the road. I can just go there, spend my money and eat something delicious. I'm fine. Both of you can enjoy the meal. Okay. But what do you mean? Will you shut up? Have you seen what it costs? Everything about, 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 about this breed is irritating. Please get out of my way before you infest me with bacteria and, and, and syphilis. Have you seen it? Yes, ma'am. Are you worthless? Yes. Are you foolish? Yes. Are you senseless? Yes. Did your mother not teach you cleanliness? He teach me. He teach me. Will you shut up? Shut, shut the ass you call mouth! Look at what you just cost. Yes. You made my son now to go upstairs. He will go out to eat while you are here. Yes. Is this how it's going to work? Huh? Local urchin. Yes. Nitwit. Yes. Yes, you dear. Stupid you. Your mother did not teach you. Is it to someone be Is that how you behave in the village? Mama, I, I, I scratched my... Shut up, shut up. I scratched my malavo. Now, you smell. You irritate me. Yes, ma. Anyhow, human dunk. But my own. My own. I told you to watch your back, but you refused. You have failed the test. Hmm? Yeah. This is not the end of this. Okay. It's not! Oh. Okay. This is not the end of it, Abby. I wait for another one. Uncle is supposed to be massaging the uncle. Ah. Mm -hmm. Anytime somebody's hand touches you. Yeah. <laughs> because the blood is very young, it's still flowing. Acha cha cha. Cha 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 cha. You call that one. Why are you smelling like this? I'm saying now. Why are you like that? What, what, why, why are you crying? What happened to you? What put on your body? Can't believe for human don't call me. What? Can you come close? Stay there, stay there. I want you to stay away from that Kambili. She's the enemy of this family. Eh? What are you doing with this? Hey, Kambili! She, she put this on you? It's alright. That Kambili, I will get it hot with her today. God damn! Hey, God damn! Go inside, right. go inside and go have your bath. Go that side, that says there. What are they then? Hi, it's okay, she grew away. Go hurry up now. What do they do? Smear everywhere. Hurry up, put it in Yes, I was just coming to your house. Huh? And you know you're not welcome in my house. Oh! Who told you I was coming to your house for pleasantries or uh, courtesy visit? You think I was coming there to come and parley with you? I was coming to come and warn you and your daughter. What's that again? Again, is it like a company or so? I was coming to warn you and her to stay away from my granddaughter, Chimwanya. If you don't, if you don't, then I will show you who I am. Your daughter, your granddaughter is very, very disrespectful. That's why she taught her the lesson of her life. A bitter one at that. I am boiling! No, no, you have the mouth to say I'm boiling! Anyway, I know your family is angry. 
very bitter because my son refused to marry your daughter. Now let me warn you. If the community, the whole community cooks for you and your family, you won't be able to finish it. Tell your daughter to stay away from my granddaughter. If not, eh? <laughs> I will so deal with all of you. You will not believe what I will do. I'm waiting for you. You're waiting? Yes, I'm waiting for you. No, you have the ghost to tell me you're waiting. I'm waiting. It's all right. We shall see. celebrate yet because the game isn't over you vanquished dragon why don't you give up i have dealt with people more bigger than you and traveled that you. you're just a small rat what's going on here thank god you're here why don't you ask this loser you call a friend how should true human don't commit the other day what can believe well, I just came here to tell you that the battle line just began. And wait for my strike. I promise you, you won't see me coming. Bobby. Just look at how you are downgrading yourself. That this little girl is talking to you as if you both are mates. Relax, see. Eh? Are you scared? She can't do anything. Anything. She cannot do anything. Relax yourself. Today is our village Afro festival. No woman nor a girl child is allowed to leave the house. If they do, what will happen? Mm. This village he dreaded masquerade, Alam Miri. We flog that person mercilessly that even you cannot imagine it. If only on the car, I so you're trying to say that the mas if the masquerade sees anyone, any woman, he's going to flog the person. Yes. Yeah. Why are you sounding like this? <laughs> you think I'm playing, right? I am very serious. It is believed that the masquerade is a spirit. Spirit. Yes. But there is uh, always a man that stands beside it to speak to it spiritually. Tell the masquerade what to do and what not to do. If you leave the house, the masquerade will flog you. I pity those that will come out. I pity you if you go out. Don't be a victim. Stay at home. Okay. Did you hear me? Okay, Mama. Hurry up and finish picking this thing. Let me go and rest. Okay. See these ones. Pick, 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 pick. Rest alone. As long as I'm not resting in peace. <laughs> Abomination. What happened? What are you doing outside? Don't you know what today is? Why are you in this village? I'm looking for. Alarm Mary Masquerade. You are looking for Alarm Mary Masquerade? Yes, I am. See, look around. You can see that everywhere is dry. See, let me tell you. If you know what is good for you, better run home now while you still have legs. Run home now, no. I've told you my own. Run home! Hmm? Hey, Mama! Mama! Hey, Mama! 
that I'm a bad friend. You grew up in this village and you are yet to know that every Afro festival, no female is allowed to step out of their house. But I didn't know. Eh? I didn't go home. What do you mean you didn't? If you didn't step out, so out of your house, how did they not flog you? I don't know. But somehow they were on Chimoya's side. Chimoya. Uh, you see? I've been telling you to stay away from that girl, but you wouldn't listen. Now they have, they have flogged the hell out of you. <laughs> no, I, I really underestimate that girl. But from now I swear I will never I will never disturb her and her family again, I swear. Eh. You, are, you, are, you are telling me so you did not offend me, but I'm happy they flogged some sense into your brain. Yeah? Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah, Hey, okay, sorry, Jesus. Don't you Don't take her for I Flogged can be lead to reckless abandon. Who told you that? Eh? Eh? Kambili knows the tradition of her people. Eh. And there is no way she will venture leave her house on Afro Festival Day. So why why would uh, 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 masquerade flog her? I saw her dress her wound. 
at all Luchi's uh, gaming shop. In fact, she was the person that told me everything. She said the masquerade attacked her on a normal day. As if it was on a secret mission. So it wasn't even on Anna for a festival day. That's because no sinner goes unpunished. <laughs> no sinner goes unpunished. I believe what you said. <laughs> this is good news. Now she has boxed herself mm -hmm. inside the cooler and she will never dream of disturbing us again. At least for now. Eh? Oh, see flogging. Etawai. <laughs> Etawai. I'm sure what I did to her, she will never look for my trouble again as long as she's still in this village. You did? You did it? <laughs> She's wise and brave, don't take her for granted. I want a baby, but very fair, and tip by kai, and tip and get. She is not a fearful child. In a go, she knows her right. Don't play with her. She's small but mighty. Go be wild. <laughs> Sleeping? Why are you not sleeping? How do you expect me to sleep when my daughter is missing? But she's with your parents. She's in safe hands. Well, she ought to be here. This is her father's house. I wanted to let the cat out of the bag tomorrow. But it seems this is the perfect time. I am pregnant. You what? I'm pregnant. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Are you telling me that you're pregnant? Yes. So please, can we go back to sleep? Wait, wait, wait first. You're serious? Baby, I can't be joking now. I am. You just made me the happiest man on earth. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so happy. I'm happy again. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Please. I guess now. Your dirty, filthy underwears is littered all over my room. Oh, will you shut up? Shut up! So it has gotten to the point that I will have to remind you to wash your dirty underwears? Will you take this nonsense outside and go wash them? What nonsense! Make sure this nonsense doesn't happen again! 
Так! from me else you will not like what I will do to you. Just bring your mouth down. Let me the doctor. Who are you? No no who are you this local village thing? Who hey. are you? Good to my local what? Now allow me I show you why they call me Philo. The fighter for my village. If I show you you see picking we know how to bomb you know Fibo now. Piki we be say everybody go just bring them from here. Pim Piki go cry. Nya 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 nya. You reach your tongue, your own con they had. Eh? Na me they talk to. You know what? You can say whatever you want. I'm not God that gives children. But please, do not speak cold water on me next time. Don't, because I will not take it easy with you. Hey! What? Is there something wrong with you? What is your problem? What is your problem? Look at my body. What is your problem? Eh? Are we mad? You talk am? Are we mad? What? What? What is? What is? What is your problem? Oh, you want to fight me? Yeah, yeah. You, 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 you want to fight me? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Move. move. I will beat you. Move, move. Ah. It will not work for you. Mama, I cannot ask what the problem is. Hey. What is the problem? I was not passing. I was on, I was on call. I should have spoiled what I mean for what? Hey! You can learn! Ah. Mama, I don't want to try to enter my water. Why did you enter her water? Why did you enter her water? Are you blind? Mama. Can't you see, Rose? Which one did I enter? Which water did I enter? Did you enter her water? I was just passing, Mama. I was just passing. Then where is the water she poured on you? You can't tell me, are we mad? Are we mad? What is this noise? What's going on here? Is it not this your barren wife? Eh? This your barren wife wants to kill my daughter-in-law. Why would you want to kill her? Are you mad? You want to kill her? You want to kill her? You want to kill her? Why are you crazy? Why are you crazy? What can I put you? Do you want me to talk to you? You want to do that? Because you can't give birth to two people. You can't give me a child. And you want to kill the one that is going to give me the child. You can't give me a child. 
finally left this house. This is the best time for you to strike and possess your possession. Okay? Mm. Mama, mm. this is your son's house, fine, oh. See my uncle. Will you shut up and listen to what I'm telling you? What I do? The number one thing you're supposed to do now is to work on your English. How to speak fluent English. My son don't like illiterates. I hear you. Um, now is the best time for you to make him marry you. Because <laughs> if he does not marry you now, I'm not sure he will ever do it. Okay. What I do is not what I do. The best way to say it is this. What will I do? Or what do I do? Okay. What do I do? What do what do I do? Or when? Or when? What do I do? Or when? Okay. What will I do? Okay. Will I? Will I do? <laughs> this is my. This is not marriage. I do. I do. What will I do? Okay. 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 Don't worry, forget about that one. Hmm? The best thing for you to do is to listen to me. I am here for you. I will guide you. I will teach you. You just have to do everything I ask you to do. And you will succeed. Yes. You will possess your position. Yes. You are the one that says that my son's house is um, fine. If I know. Uh -huh. If you do what I ask you to do, it will be your house. You will be the madam of this house. Now, come. Bring your ear. Let me tell you what to do. Atabi Kulamit. Oh dear, my heart 
That as we speak right now, that lady is still in the house. Oh, you open. She is. The worst part is the lady in question. She's she's always looking for my trouble. She's always looking for my trouble. I've tried to avoid her so many times. Then I was on my own. She just sprinkled water on me. The dirty water she did to wash but she sprinkled it on me. And when I got confronted, I started beating me up. My mother-in-law gave my husband, all of them joined her to beat me. Hey! They beat. Ah. It's okay, my ears are tingling. Ah. As you have given this story, my, my ears are tingling. Take her inside. Mm. See, mm. you are now in your father's house. Mm. Nobody will come here and hurt you. Mm. Mana Juliana, ah. you have a child. Mm. Let's go inside. The busy now. You will get okay. It's okay. The busy now. You are in safe place now. Don't worry. Come back, I will carry them. Take her inside. After you say, don't take her off you. Um, Papa, uh, please. Um, you, you called me. Yes, so if you want to tell me whatever you want to tell me, be fast about it. Make it snappy so I can go back to the city and take care of my wife. Pico. Like seriously? Seriously. I should take it snappy? <laughs> this boy has uh, developed uh, wings. In any case, um, it's been a while since you asked after your daughter. You've not even given a call to find out how she's doing and we are not happy about it. I've been here severally to take her along with me. But she refused going with me. You people do not want to release her to me. What do you want me to do? Eh? I've tried my best. She can stay here for all I care. I've tried. Will you shut up? Will you shut up with your stupid mouth? Exactly. It is obvious that your stupid wife has been brainwashing you and feeding you with so much negativity. Mama, Mama you can call me names. You can insult me. But please, do not call my wife names. If she does, what will you do? Maybe flap me. Hmm? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? This is the only thing your late wife entrusted to you before her demise. The only thing left of her memory. And you can't take care of her. She'll be ashamed of yourself. You are ashamed of yourself. You left your husband's house. You rap with Betty. Not a banana nagi. You're here. Parents' house, chilling, relaxing, here talking rubbish. 
You should put that energy. And go back to your house and make it work. Not coming here to tell me that I'm ashamed. You should be the one ashamed of yourself. They get a chair with him. I can't tell you that you can't do that kind of nonsense. Then my friend, the other was thrown into the dark. No, 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 no matter why. And you will not say something, Akachi. Say something, you're the man of the house. Please, if there's something else you want to say, say it. I want to go back to the city and take care of my pregnant wife. Oh! Oh! This is what all this is all about. Your pregnant wife. When I come around, we will take care of her. Oh. Oh. Now I come around, I'm going to go to You don't know that a, a, a bear that hand is worth more than a million in the bush. Exactly, Mama. My mother will She will give birth to God. Not a baby. Um, I have to go back to the city now. Hey, hold it, young man. Okay. One more step. And I will show you that I'm your father. How dare you? How dare you walk out on me? Disrespect me in the presence of my family. Let this be the first and the last time you will disrespect me like that. This meeting is not over. It drops. Papa, Papa, see if there's nothing important to talk about, please, I need to go. Really? Go. Move, let me see. Move to where? Move, I, let me see. Can you stop this boy? Let me you shouldn't let me go, right? You need to remove you need to pim pim pom pim pom pim. Come on, na na na. Yeah? You people want to press me, control me, right? I, I'm, I'm leaving, you know. You're pausing me here. No, try it! Papa. Leave, let me see! Papa. Papa, stop him. I know him very well. I know him very well. Once he enters that car, you don't go. If he goes like that, is it? You don't have Let him try it! You don't have anything to say. Yeah? Papa, he's going, you know. Papa, I play myself, I move. Move, now, let me see. Pa Papa, he's going, Papa, do something. Yeah, leave it! Akashi. You know, Papa, I know him very well. Come on, he will go. Who do you do anything? I'm a gang, come on. Papa, forget about his height. Forget about his height. Can you see that I'm an old man? What do you mean? You want me to go outside? Don't him, not Mama. Go back, Biko. Keep your hat, your sword. No, you, you be the one shot. You were the one who made that to leave me. Who made him to leave me? You be shot it. Papa, come back. He opposed me on my way back, and I stop and have an accident. Eh? Why him, me, me, mother? Oh man, do come, mama. Wakey, 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 wakey. Good morning, baby. Good morning, baby. Get up and have your breakfast. What did you make? My tea and bread for you. Mm, that's so romantic of you. You're welcome. Okay. Go ahead and. <laughs> Breakfast in bed. Yeah. You know? Mm. Okay. Is it hot? Very hot. The way you like it. Well, I don't know what the problem is. I mean, it's been a while and your father has not thought it wise to give us a call to at least know how you are faring. I mean, this is not fair. That's an evidence to show you that he doesn't love me anymore. I don't want to go back to him. I want to stay with you and grandma. Don't talk like that. Look, your father loves you so much. That I can tell. Eh? It's just that uh, he's been manipulated. Uh, look, you can come to visit us anytime you like, okay? But for you to live with us permanently is not good when your father is still alive, I know. Right? My father rejected me because of that infidel he calls a wife that is pregnant. Ah, come on. Don't talk about your stepmom like that. 
After all, the baby she's carrying in her womb is still your sibling. Huh? Grandpa. Yes. I want you to do something for me. Uh, what is it? I want you to call my stepmom and my dad. Tell them that it's a matter of life and death. First day tomorrow, they should be here. Life and death? Who is living and who is dying? Grandpa, when the time comes, you will know. Please just tell them. There is nothing more we will not see in this family in this house. Huh? Look at these idiots. Someone I brought from the village to brush her up. Even though she refused to be brushed up, she now has the mouth to talk back at me. Ha! Hmm! Mwa wapa, omube. Uchebe to go to be that. Ha! He can go smelling. Ha! Oh! What are you saying? She not going to be like Come! See! If you not change them now, eh? Nobody go watch anything for here. You not go play, I go, I go scatter. Girl is mad. She's mad. Mama. Ah! What's going on? What is going on? Who are you looking for? What is this? What happened to my television? Is it not your wife? Mama, can you stop? Who is my wife? Please, what happened to my television? Oh. It's Philomena. That girl, she's mad. She was watching telly. And I came in, changed the channel. I asked her to go to the kitchen and they wash the dishes. The next thing I saw, she ran into the room and came out with a flower vest. She chased me out. I, I, I just came in now and saw that she broke the telly. Philomena! Philomena! Come here. What happened to my television? Now your mama happened to the television. Yes. Husband, I sit down here. They they watch a one man where they make me laugh for here. So I can't sit down here, they laugh. The man they make me they laugh. They make me they laugh. So they laugh now as the man they make me laugh. Now your mama can't come out. Come follow me. They laugh. Sit down here with me. Come carry that thing where then they use um press press. That thing where you if you press them. Then the man can't come out. He can't come out that man where they make me happy. Now come verse say, make you put them back, make you put that man back. The mama no agree put the man back. And the mama, I, I can't sit down here I, as I they tell them put that. Put that man back, put that man back. He can't say, are we mad? I can't say yes, are we mad? I not say that are we mad, they make me mad. Now I converse, as I converse, now I run. I run, I use run, come up from me. I know, I know what I, I run, 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 run. Go there, go see that, uh, that's something where they use to put three. I can't carry them. As I carry them, come, I do like this. Now the thing come, boom, the thing come land. Now for for the this thing, the this thing where that man they show that time. The can you gone. can you just listen to yourself? Yes. Can you hear yourself talk? Yes. Listen, you are going to replace that television screen with your money, and if it is beyond repairs, you will have to buy another one. Ha! 
You are not going to change it. You will buy a new one. Since you are mad, you, they you must buy a new one. Yes. You see, I'm, you don't come again. Are we mad? You don't come again for your front now. Say, are we mad? You don't follow will me. Will you shut up? Shut up! You and your mama, when I don't plan, I'm a bee. When I don't plan, I'm so I go change her. Which, which money? You go buy another one. Mama, no, no, no. Carry your hand, go up. No, carry and go up. No, carry and go up. You realize you are raising your voice in my presence. Yes. There's something wrong with you? Yes. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. I cost it. I cost everything. I don't blame you. No, it's fine. Please relax. Philomena, would you put yourself in check? Check. Huh? Check and I say make you check and Shut up! What is your problem? Can't you shut that asshole you call mouth up for once? No go talk now. Hey, hey, hey. Ah, no they do ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Don't come again ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. No be a we mad again now nah, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Bring that man up. Make you come out too. Oh. Make you come out too. Oh. In fact, see, I make make you not allow make my my vest come out no because I won't make you come out now. Nah. I go scatter anywhere where I see. I go scatter anything where they are. I go scatter them now. Bring them now. Man. You know, I go scatter everything. In fact, make I go put myself for mood now. Hey! Well, where did you get this refrain from? Hey! Hey! It's all my fault. It's all my fault. Oh. Say you they want me, say you they want me, say you they want me. Philomena, what is the meaning of this nonsense that you are doing? First, it was the television that you broke. Secondly, you wouldn't let us have peace in the house. You are almost done drinking a bottle of whiskey. Disturbing the whole house, what for? They catch cruise now. What hey. nonsense cruise? Mo mo mother, please, what is the meaning of this? What is going on here? See for yourself. Hey, you me. Philomena. What is wrong with you? Are you insane? She's wearing the same pants she used to put on her head. Hey! Let me let her stand. Hold me, come! Who are you holding? Tim, Tim, Have you have you seen that you have normal? Are you mad? What is wrong with you? Hey! Eh? Why are you behaving like an idiot? Old woman! Now me they talk to you. Eh? Hi. Blind like and crazy. So. Are you mad? Are you crazy? How dare you talk to my mother in that tone? My head they told me, but I didn't see double double here. He said, are we mad? Again? Hi. Hey! This slap will slap me, don't scatter my brain! You don't scatter my brain! Are you mad again? Mother, how could you do this? I told you 
you to. But I told you to get me a wife. Not my doom. How was I supposed to know that she's this way? She told me that in her village they call her Philo the fighter. I didn't know that this was what she meant. How was I supposed to know? Or that you have finished me. How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me? Eh? You lied about her village. You lied about her educational status. You even went as far as teaching her ways to use and communicating with me. All for what? Just because you want the yellow mat of this house. Now, 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 look at what is going on. Hey. Sorry, 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 please. Sorry, sorry. I didn't know she's this way. I'm sorry. I didn't know she's this way. Hello, Dipu. Dipu, I need your help. Someone is trying to kill me in my house. Please, I need you to send your boys as soon as possible. Yes, now, now. Please, Dipu, hurry. Please. What did he say? Down the way. Sorry, 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 please. Hey, hey. Hey. What am I doing? Sorry now, sorry, please. Sorry for everything. Thank God the police have taken her away. We can now live in peace. Listen, I regret listening to all the bad advices that you gave me. I regret it. Now, now, now look at where this whole thing has landed us. Just, just take a good look. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it this way. Please. Mayalo was a good woman. She was a decent wife, but guess what, mother? You frustrated her life. You frustrated her out of this marriage. Now, now, just look at the whole thing. Just look, mother, you are evil. Mbano, it have not reached to this. Eh? It's too harsh. I'm still your mother. You are my mother, but you have not behaved like a good mother. No mother because of your greed and selfishness for grandchildren. Just, just look at what you did to my life. You've messed my life up. Hey. Hey. Hey, Rebuama. I thought I wanted to come to the field for a meeting. Every day meeting. I'm not going no. Why? Because I don't feel like it. My father said we must be there. It's about life and death. Hmm? So we have to. First thing tomorrow morning.
Your craving has changed drastically lately. Yes. I wouldn't line. Is it food? I have this urge for sour food. And if I don't have it, I'll feel like throwing up. That's why I'm taking it. Well, um, mm -hmm. when last did you see your period? Pregnant. Mm -hmm. You are pregnant, it didn't me. Mama. How will you know that? I am a woman. I know that craving. I had the same craving when I was pregnant with you. Hey! It didn't me. Mama, if this is true. God. Ah! If this is true, Mama will be the happiest person on earth. Pregnant. Hey! God. God. Mama, what do we do now? Mommy, I know you're pregnant. But first, let us go to the hospital and confirm. So I'll be sure. Hospital? Yes. Mama, let's go. Oh, yeah. Quickly go and dress. Let's go to the hospital and be sure. Yes. Mama, I'm okay like this. We can go like this. I'm okay. Uh, no problem. Let me change my bathroom slippers and probably wash my leg. My bathroom slippers is looking very nice on you. Uh, Therefore, I should carry the truth slippers to the hospital. Yes, Mama. And yes. you're looking fine. Mama, Mama. Oh, dear, let me go and change my truth slippers and wash my legs. Mama. Hey! I'm pregnant. Ah! Mama, please, hurry up. I need to go to the hospital. Please, Mama. Now that uh, we have confirmed that uh, you are indeed pregnant, uh, I think it's time you went home to see your husband so that uh, you can break the news to him. Mm -hmm. Papa, I won't do that. It's been almost two weeks that I came back to this village and my husband is yet to call to know how I'm faring. I'm not going anywhere, Papa. No. In as much as I hate to say this, your father is right. You cannot continue to stay in this house. Eh? We have not returned your bride price yet. Are we planning to? Not at all. Uh -huh. ha, he's still your husband traditionally. Mama, my husband is an irresponsible weakling. How am I supposed to do that? When he has another woman at home. How? No, yeah. Look, as far as we are concerned, your husband can harbor so many women in his house. That's not our business. All we know is that you are the only one that is married to him. Simple. And so he remains your husband. Papa, Papa, today is not a sad day. Today is a day of joy. Let us celebrate and leave my husband and his issues for today. Please, Papa. Mama, please. I told you that God will surprise you with a child. When you least expect it. Yes, you did. I'm so glad my prayer worked. Thank you so much. Thank God. Wow. Thank you. I'm so happy. Ah, my you're little right. angel. You are right. This is the day of celebration. Exactly, oh, yeah. Papa. Go to my bedroom. You will see uh, Papa wine there. Bring it. Let us celebrate. Uh -uh. Yes, yes, yes. Back then too. We should drink as well. Who told you that wine is bad for old baby? No, this one, Mama. Uh huh. We will out a bottle of stout. Eh? Eh. Uh -huh. Even if you don't drink from me, two of us. Hey, Papa, we we'll still have a taste of it. Ah, uh, look at you. <laughs> don't mind two of us, so we are not old, though. Um, Chimwanya. I called for this meeting at your instance. You specifically requested that uh, I invite Mazu be here uh, because you felt he's a man of high integrity, he's full of wisdom and he's very sincere. Then on top of that is uh, an encyclopedia of our customs and tradition. 
So for you to go to such extent, it means what you want to tell us is uh, something of utmost importance. So, we are all ears. Talk to us. Thank you, Papa, for the honor. Thank you, Maziobi, for coming. You are welcome, my daughter. What's the meaning of this? Huh? Anyway, whatever you have to say, make it snap. Because I need to be in the city ASAP. My unborn child cannot withstand the harsh weather in this village. Yay! Oh! <clears throat> I don't intend to take much of your time. When my father married you into our home, I thought you were the best mom anyone could ever have. Suddenly, you changed. But the thing that helped me the most is that I caught you making call with another man while my dad was off to war. And you go out to see the same man to God knows where. How ridiculous. Wait, is this why you brought me out of my comfort? Honey, you see? I told you these people have nothing productive to say. But you kept on insisting. It's a matter of life and death. It's a matter of life oh, and death. Shut up. Because right here and now, I will teach you how not to talk rudely. Especially when you are in the midst of your elders. Napwala, are you mad or something? Let her talk. I'm sure she is not yet done talking. So allow her. I'm not. Of course I'm not done talking. Mm -hmm. All right. I also heard you telling the same man that you're going to tell your husband you'll be taking some clothes to the dry cleaner. And you're going to waste much time there. So I came up with a plan. How are you today? I'm fine, thank you. Mommy never has had my greetings. I know. And I'm very sorry. Listen. Give me a I want us to start up on the fresh clean slate. No fighting, no quarreling. You know, I want us to live together like a mother and a daughter should. Okay. <laughs> Which is why I especially went to the supermarket to get you bananas. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. You're welcome. I know how much you love bananas. I love you. I love you more. <laughs> I'll be upstairs, okay? Okay, mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and there are granites inside. Okay. okay. <laughs> I can't wait. Mm -hmm. Where? Uh, I think I like when you kiss me on the forehead. You know. <laughs> Naughty! <laughs> Why should you make me scream so loud? <laughs> <coughs> I 
What are you doing there? Uh, uh, I mean, how long have you been standing there? I just, uh, uh, what did you hear? I did not hear anything. I just came now. And why are you asking? Oh, nothing. I just uh, didn't know that you were back from school. I came back from school, but you were in your room, so I decided not to disturb you. Okay. Just go back to your room. Let me make you something nice to eat. She's wise and brave. Don't take her for granted. I wanna Bobby. Anti She does not a fearful child. In go. She knows her right. Don't play with her. She's small but mighty. Bobby one. Small but mighty. This one you brought me here. Hope there's no problem. I'll talk to you for a favor. And promise me you won't tell anyone about it. Am I mad? Hey, man. Tell who? Huh? I promise. Okay. Huh? My stepmom would. My stepmom will. What is it? You do go ahead and talk. My stepmom will call you to carry a bag filled with clothes inside to put inside the car. Mm. So she will take it to the laundry. It's going to be heavy, but you have to carry it regardless. Just that. It's nothing now. It's just that why I was squeezing my face. It was because that's. That's your auntie, your stepmother. I did mention her name, turns my belly. If we, she know be better person. I know that Koko Mark would. If we, I just wish Oga go notice her. If we, oh meanwhile, you said the bag full of clothes, and you also said that it will be heavy. How come? She's going to be tough. I'll be inside. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, what if something happens? What if you could not breathe inside there? Or something happens? I will die before my time. Hey! You promise. You promise you're going to do it and stop asking too much questions. Well, you're at it. Make sure you keep the bag, Aja. Aja again. Aja again. What is Aja? Like, make the zip of the bag open a little bit. So I could be able to breathe. It can be easy for me to come out. Oh, wonderful. Now you have come. If I will run for you now. Hey, man. I will run for you. Oh, you are, you are. I will do it for you now. Okay. I know I can at least count on you. Hey, go ahead and count on you. <laughs> I am going to do it for you. Go ahead. Okay. Oh, you are, you are. <laughs> hey. I will not put it. Hey, what's up? Where are you up to? I want to go. Laundry. Laundry? And you're applying all this makeup on your face? I don't care where I'm going to. 
I have to always look good so that the world will see that you are married to a pretty woman. Yeah, I know, but oh. that's really too heavy, you know? Oh, this? And the, and the cloth, yeah, it's too oh. plenty. Oh, you know it's been long since we last took our clothes to the laundry. Oh, yeah, I've been so busy all this while, yeah. You're right. I know, I know. Emeka! Emeka! Take this to the car. Eh, 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 I should be the one asking you that. You brought him, so tell us where did you get him from? See you, babe. Okay. Nice day. Mm hmm. forgotten about our plan. Oh, how can I? How can I? I still got that in mind. Once I make enough money from him, mm -hmm. I will settle it low somewhere very far. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. that's fine. But you know, the way you hit me those days without protection, you might get me pregnant. And wouldn't you like it? Oh, come on. You know I'm a married woman. Oh, okay. Married woman. <laughs> Sorry, what's this? Like, what's oh. this bag for? I told him I was going to the laundry so I can come see you. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, well, anything to see you. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I didn't. I'll leave you. 
catch up with you later. Okay. Mm. <laughs> I love you. Okay. Take good care of yourself. I baby. will. Right. You too. You too. <laughs> All right, later. Yeah. She's wise and brave, don't take her for granted. I believe that she is not a fearful child. She knows her right, don't play with her. She's small but mighty, Bobby Moa. Small but mighty, small to me, she's not in size. Silent, no be wickedness. To bomb my head, no be maloba. Small but mighty, small to me, she's not in size. Silent, no be wickedness. To bomb my head, no be maloba. Oh my goodness! Why do you hate me so much? Why? What is I ever too wrong to you? What kind of lie is this? Lies from the pit of hell! Lies from the pit of hell! You've never been happy with me right from where your father married me! What did I do? What did I do? Leave her, let her act. Nollywood. I have pictures and a voice record of your discussion with the man. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes? Let's hear it. <laughs> Can you play it for us too? I'll play it for Hey! Hey! That's one gig. Mm. I bumped into you when you were still making the same call with the man. So you decided to make plans by throwing me out of my own father's house. Hey, 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 hey. Ha! Party. Ha! Ha! Is this how you... Jesus. This is wicked. That's one gig. That's one of hey. the... Hmm. You, see? It? Mm. you see? The baby she's crying in her womb is not yours. Hey, Kupone. Hey! How's that? I will say the truth. I will talk. The 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 that I I is asleep on the stairs. I, I, I didn't have miscarriage. It, 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 it was planned. Uh, I was not pregnant. Hi. <laughs> and in the hospital we went to, I already planned with the doctor before we came. I was where I insisted we go there. Please. Abomination. Hmm? Abomination. If it were in the days of our forefathers, you would be stoned to death. And your evil cause will be thrown into the forest. Hmm. Or the worst than be thrown into the evil forest. Hmm. Hmm. Hey. You shot me. You are a devil. You are a snake. In fact, I combine it, you are a devilish snake. Sent to my home. 
destroy my family and I. Commando, hey. not again. Ah! To come and wait there. See, the heart of man is not only desperately wicked, but dark! Dark! Exactly. Hi! Catherine, so you were buying time. You were buying time for you to be able to destroy my son. Waiting for the best time to kill him so that you can back all his money and elope with your worthless boyfriend. Imezwe. Imezwe na. Na mi ane ka wo. Mama. Hey! Kati. All this we have planned. You never broke up with Jeffrey. You never did. Jeffrey. You were secretly seeing him. Even after you got married to my brother. Forgive me. Why are you still seeing the Jeffet? Forgive me, Mama, Papa. Which Mama? Please. Oh my God. Please. Forgive me. I am still your daughter. Oh, see, daughter. God forbid that I will have a snitch as a daughter. Like you. God forbid that I will have you as a daughter. Look, as we speak, eh, her parents would have been twisting themselves uncomfortably in their graves. Whose daughter are you? Please, forgive me. My husband, I am sorry. I still love you very, very much. Love kill you very, very much. Love more than more in fact. May that love deal with you. You are a devil. You know what is love? Hi! Who is the father of that unborn child? Here comes the man that is responsible for the child. Hey! I invited him over. I took his number from your phone because I know one day I will need it. Oh, well, Jeff, I'm Alpha. Um, I want to introduce myself. My name is Jaffet, and I'm here to take what rightfully belongs to me. I mean, my wife and my unborn child. Baby, let's go. Are, you, are you mad? Is something wrong with you? Uh, Where did you fly in from? Who go, who go with you? Me. I will never step an inch with you. I'm going nowhere with a poverty infested wanderer like you. I'd rather abort this child than have it for you. A wanderer, my mother. Oh, what? Hi. Jeff, I don't know. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Calm down. Yeah. Um, my daughter, except you want to die a slow and painful death. Our custom and tradition strictly kick against abortion any maiden in this village who indulges herself in abortion will die a slow and painful death our custom and tradition states that if you are carrying a man's child and refuse to move in with him during the time of childbirth he can pronounce a curse against you and it must happen my candid advice to you is go with him. Mazi, may God bless you for your words. Thank you very much. Baby, let's go. Hey, 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 hey Catherine! Yeah. Catherine! Yeah. Go with him. Go you. with your uh, husband. Uh, see, uh, we will come and collect our bride prize uh, as soon as body. possible. Just, bye bye. Cha cha cha. Hey, nonsense. I don't want to catch a fight though. Mm -hmm. Hi. What is this? What is this? Now I'm Your baggage. My pregnant wife. I'm going to attend to my pregnant wife. Nowadays.
My daughter. My angel. Please. Find a place in your heart to forgive me. Your mommy. My late wife. Asked me to take care of you. But I've failed her. Please, I want you to forgive me, please. To air is human. To forgive is human. I have forgiven you already before you ask. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. What are you doing here? Go to the Where is your camp? Go to the jungle. Fendi, um, Fendi. Please, no, no, no. I have come to say that we are sorry. And thank God that you are all here. I beg for your forgiveness. Mostly you, no, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for all I did to you. I'm sorry for all I made my son do to you. Honestly, you did nothing to me. You did not wrong me in any way. I hated you. I didn't want my son to marry you. That was the reason I did all those things to you. Forgive me. I promise it will not happen again. Please. Mona uh, Balea, Juliana, if you have repented, know that the devil has equally repented. No point to This Juliana you are seeing now is not that Juliana you used to know. This is a changed Juliana. Why didn't you give him his cap, Why didn't you give him? This is the New devil, the old devil has repented. Okay. No, Nayalum. I know that there is nothing I would say or do that would atone for the wrongs that I did to you. All the pains that I caused you. Please, I'm begging you to find a place in your heart to forgive me. If you decide not to forgive me, I deserve it. But I want you to know that. I love you so much, with or without a child. Where is your cup of wickedness, old Junko? Where is Lisa. it? You didn't come with it. Oh, Lisa. You. You stripped me off my self esteem. I couldn't even look myself in the mirror without remembering the hurtful words you and your mother said to me. Hey, Neno. No, you know, my go as a Eh? Stop counting. I want my go as a my email. Hmm. My name is my boy. I go as a. Is it to book so you mal? You know, fellow, you know, behave the way you like. Please, just give me one more chance, and I promise you that I will spend the rest of my life making it up to you. Please, I beg you. Hmm. How? How will you do? That? Have you forgotten? So soon. Oh, Lisa, have you forgotten so soon? You opened your mouth and you called me a rocky crowd. I'm sorry. Please. Oh, Lisa, you broke my heart. You shattered it. You tore it into pieces. Sorry. I showed you love. I gave you my all. And yet, you and your mother Used you used me as a rag. And here you are. Here you are. Asking me. It's okay now. Asking me. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. But what is that? Let me bust you up. Let me bust you up. This. This rocky ground. 
as you called it. A seed is growing inside of it now. Yes. I don't understand. How will you understand? How will you say? But you know what? I forgive you. I forgive you and your mother. Because God, God has answered my prayers. Mama, God has answered her prayers. And she's pregnant. Yes. What? Hey! God, thank yes. you. Gaba. Gaba. Juliana, Juliana, you're going to Gaba. Where is it? Go to the Naga and I'm going to the China. Furuzo. They are coming to hug her. Don't hug her. Mama, I'm sorry. Why didn't you come with that girl? Mama is okay. Mama is okay. Baby, pregnant. Hey! 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 Papa. Hey! 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 Oh God! What kind of a team is this now? Eh? Can somebody sleep in this house? What kind of a nonsense is this? Eh? I will go to work. After carrying block on my head, I will still come back to my house. I will not rest. How can you rest when you are useless? No, the... Wait, wait, is it me I'm talking to? Is it me I'm talking to like that? Mm -mm. You know, I've always known that you are poor, but not deaf. Just imagine... Imagine the shit hole you are living in. If you're going in, if you're going in, then look at it. Imagine the shit hole you are living in. You knew you. You knew you were not ready to get married. Yet you impregnated me. Why? Why, Jeffrey? Hey! Where can I go? What are you doing here? What are you doing here since? Hey! You pass me off. Goodness me, just imagine. Just, just imagine. Look at the uncompleted building you are living in. You do not even have common electrical connection. Talk more of fun. Fun. It wants to finish me in this place. Hey! Jeffat. Jeffat, you have ruined my life. You have ruined my life! You are useless! You are very useless! I'm useless! You are useless! I'm useless! Yes! I'm useless! 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 I'm I'm not going to be able to Fafu gadi fa manu ma fa onya jife Ne gadi fa na jato de nuwa Kachupu nere gina bu agagi Yet you don't care You don't know what you have You use your fake life to destroy yourself Manu wa nobody is God All this evil is in vain Hello, you can pretend no God is watching. Maluba, nobody is God. All this evil is in vain. Hello, you can pretend no God is watching.
Pablo, Pablo, Pablo.